Howdy everyone. Hope everyone's having a wonderful Saturday, right? It's Saturday, right? Heck yeah it is. Hope everybody's been having a great day. <sighs> I've been ready to play some more. I've been taking it pretty slow today though, so... Here I am now in the evening, ready to play some. So let's get into it. We got so much crazy stuff to get into now. Like this game just is continuously going above and beyond. And I love it. Oof. I'm a little sore today, so I'm hoping that I'll be able to sound entertaining, but if not, we'll probably just end up wrapping it up and taking it easy, because nobody wants to watch a stream where nobody's feeling too good, right? I spilled that drink. Ha ha ha. Yikes. Just trying to get. Okay. I should be good to go now. I hope y'all are ready to go. Ah, uh, yep. Yeah. Because I am definitely ready to go. Got a little workout earlier this morning. Hopefully that'll do some good for the bones. And by bones I mean muscles, but it's basically the same thing, right? Like, there's hardly any difference between bone and muscle. So, here we are at another colony. Ooh. So, you know what that means. We got some liberating to do. Whoa. That smarts. Poor Noah. He got to beat up. <laughs> it feels good to be sitting. Whoa, I feel like I've been sitting stop. down today, but with how I'm feeling, maybe I've been more active than I thought today. So this might be a much needed sit down and game sesh. Alright. Talk with Matka. Interesting. Is there any quest here to happen? Yeah, right up by the flame clock. Are we seriously gonna do it now? Those Gavessi dudes are still loitering around. Who's loitering again? God, he's huge! 
sounded like someone was having a bit of a whinge. We all good here? We're great. Right, Talo? But right, Chief. No whinge in here. Say again? N nothing to say, really. <laughs> huh. I'll take your word for it. Time is of the essence. Sorry to rush, but can we get straight to the point? What should we talk about first? Hmm. You said the consul was away. Do you know how long for? Tell you bluntly, we don't know either. She's always disappearing, going off on one special mission or another. In that case, she could be back at any time. I'm sorry that the answer isn't very useful. This all sounds like kind of a big deal. It doesn't bother you. It's nothing special. We don't normally talk much about it. She just sends us down broad stroke orders, like, go defeat those guys, send a team to this location. Yeah, the only time she spoke normally was that one time, wasn't it? You know, the time when Fiona became commander. Yuck, do we have to talk about that? About what? When the previous commander died, Fiona clung to the consul's knees. Huh? Started saying that the way we fought was making everyone miserable. Yeah, it turned into a whole, like, debate. Until the consul was like, fine then, you try and change it. And made Fiona the commander. What? Just like that? Interesting. I know, it was a twisted kind of punishment. But now I've got everyone else tangled up in this mess. Whatever. We know you just want the best for us, Fifi. That's why you get yourself in such a tizzy. And that's why we want to support you in turn. You're good, Fiona. Better than you know. Hmm. Thanks, guys. Punishing someone with a promotion? That's so bizarre. But it worked, didn't it, Noah? That freaking sucks. You said nobody knows where your real flame clock is except the console. How are we supposed to find it then? I don't suppose we could just ask the console. <laughs> right. Oh, come on. Why the huge sigh? I was just asking. Someone had to ask. Sure. Well, it has to be somewhere or the status quo wouldn't be maintained. If you fight, the flame clock must fill up. Suppose you were to harvest a large pool of life in a short time. Oh, it would flow into the real clock. Mm -hmm. I'd like to investigate any large-scale combat engagements you may have experienced. If we're lucky, someone may have witnessed some signs of the flame clock's operation. Can we take a look into your past battle records? Of course. I'll have them delivered to you. Okay. So those are the important parts. So, this whole clock breaking thing's kind of a sudden development, yeah? I wanted to ask how you lot feel about all this. We know how Fiona feels, but are you all okay with what we're about to do? Honestly, I just want Fiona to be able to relax, like not have to carry all this responsibility. That's so kind of you. Even if we do this, people will still die. Yeah, but if they do, it will be because of their own failure. That's not the same. She carries the banner for us, and it's because of us that it's so heavy. But that weight's also the momentum that keeps her moving forward. I don't want us doing anything that could sully the purity of Fiona's conscience. All right, all right. Let's all take some deep breaths. We're all friends here. Keep it civil. I'm happy that you're so concerned for me. Thank you. Well, I reckon things will work out one way or another. I mean, come on. You've got us on your side. Yeah, you tell him, Lance. No one wants to lose their mates. Just don't lose track of what matters, yeah? 
I feel like Lanz has been getting some character development. He's never been a bad dude, but he's always been like close and cut off. He's like being real cool with other people right now though. Um, I mean, we don't really need any of this information. Guess we can ask while if we're the current here. flame clock is fake, what happens when your rank goes up? As far as I know, I don't think that's ever happened. Wait, you're joking. You've always been on the same level. Nico, that's me. Heard something from the console one time. She said to tough it out and do exactly as instructed, and everything would be all right. Oh? I was told something else. People only see what they want to see, I think it was. Uh, meaning? Meaning nobody actually wants to see how much is left on their clock, I guess. Well, yeah. I mean, if you knew, you'd just stress out over it constantly. A little more stressing wouldn't go amiss in your case, Tallow, you turkin head. God dang. What? Why'd you gotta call me names? Just cause. Wow. Well, we don't know exactly what the console intended. But she must have had something in mind to go to these lengths rigging the contraption. You said the colony's flame clock was a fake. What did you mean by that? Wow, pretty blunt, huh? Honestly, we don't really know any more beyond the fact that it's a fake. Since we never use it anyway, yeah? When it's close to running dry, we get orders from the console to go out and fight. Well, what is it for then? Do you think maybe there's some weird advantage to it? Like, maybe the colony's rank is really high, but it makes it look lower to get enemies to underestimate us. Or, or the exact opposite. Actually, we're bottom tier, but it looks a lot higher to intimidate people. Oh yeah, it could be that. Well, your actual strength doesn't change, so it'd be pretty obvious once you get down to it. And also, supplies from the castle are allocated based on rank. Could we see your supplies? That would give us a good idea of where you fall, rank-wise. Hmm. True. Nico's on warehouse detail. And I'm Nico. I'll get things ready for your inspection. She very much enjoys letting us know that she's Nico. I think we've more or less heard all we need. Yeah, I think so too. It's time to get to work. Let's check out the loose threads we've uncovered. <clears throat> we should investigate the supplies in the warehouse and the colony's battle record data. Is that right? Yeah. I'll make sure everyone gives you their full cooperation. We'll also try looking around for anything we might have missed. If anything turns up, we'll be in touch. Good to add more names. Oh, yeah. Right now, sure. Frost, Sean. You said you'd come back, you liars. Sorry to bother you. We were hoping to check out the old battle records. Ah, uh, right. Fifi said to expect you. Bear with me for a moment. Alright, I have transferred the data. If you see anything interesting, let me know. Thank you, we will. I see some relations have changed. Good to add more names. There's Nico. Welcome to Nico's warehouse. I'm Nico, and this is my, well, not exactly mine, but it's like a warehouse, alright? But it's a warehouse, alright? Look around all you like. Thanks, that won't be but a minute. Nothing here really stands out. It's all as I'd expect from a colony with their rank. With the rank their flame clock says they are. 
By the way, are you the one who does inventory management here? No, I think it might be the console. Nico only watches the warehouse. Nico, I should say, is me. Why would a console do that themselves? This is one weird console we're dealing with here. I see some relations have changed. I hope there's a chance that this Better console sure is not well extremely dangerous. She might somewhat care for these kids here. She only has early termers, which is weird. Could you all come around for a second? Okay, let's not mince words. Colony move is weird. And this is why you can't make friends. I've looked into their combat records. For the past few years, there have been no large-scale combat engagements involving Colony Moo. That in and of ter that in of itself is understandable, but we can't do the investigation survey thing you brought up earlier, right? Back to the drawing board then. Well, perhaps, but what really caught me, really caught my eye, was the wastelessness, so to speak. Without any big wins or losses, not only were there no large wind swings to the flame clock total, there were also no interruptions to the colony's supply chain over the long term. So what's that prove except that Fiona and the others are fending well for themselves? I've got to say, that's not really the impression I got off this place at first glance. We heard him chatting. They don't really seem to get a whole lot of training or strategy. And think about the personnel turnover. You saw the flower garden. Notice how young they all are. And that add to add to that the console's extended periods of absence. Ignoring the sake of the argument, the insecure environment. The colony's military results couldn't really afford such stability. Come to think of it, didn't Fifi say their colony ranks stayed the same? Right, and the flame clock issue is odd as well. I couldn't stop wondering what the point of the deception was. We said we thought it could be to fool enemies, but the soldiers here aren't given information. It's not even being manipulated just flat out not being supplied. Fiona and the others didn't seem bothered by it, but I think in the real world it wouldn't do them any real favors. Right? Of the two sides, it's actually Fiona and the others that it affects. What was it Tyler said? Something about not stressing all the time? Well, back the snuff up. I'm not saying the people the console wanted to deceive was the residents of Colony Moo all along? There's one more thing that bothers me. Looking at Fiona and the others, didn't they remind you of someone? They don't believe in anything beyond what they can see in the moment, still thinking that fighting is everything. Like we did way back when. Right. They're so occupied with the reality put in front of them, they don't think anything beyond that horizon. In Colony Moo's case, they don't seem much interested in anything apart from the banner that Fiona carries. True that. As soon as it's, as soon as it's about Fiona, they all get super passionate. You think they're being used? No. It's not a question of being used or otherwise. I'd imagine we're only seeing what we want to see. So that's why Fiona was appointed commander. Because she's useful for hiding whatever's inconvenient. If the console had to go to such lengths to devise this, then there can only be one reason. The console is betraying Colony Mu. 
the raid we interrupted must have been there doing as well. Then we've got to tell Fifi straight away. Hmm. I don't know. This is a really weird console we're dealing with. It's kind of hard to tell what's going to happen. And if that raid was Let's intended by their console, then the console should already be here. Oh no! What's going on? It's like back at Colony 4. My console's already here. Another Mobius messing with us! Crap! Towel! Hey! What's wrong with you? Mm. Sorry about this, bud! Towel! Don't worry. He'll be all right, but now... <gasps> Muse Consul. It was you, wasn't it? Very sneaky. Reality, right? It's just so dull. That's why nobody pays it any mind. They'd rather chase pretty dreams. You really should have just stayed dreaming. <gasps> why would you do something like this? When someone close to you gets hurt, you want to become stronger for them. That desire and sadness, they make for a quality flame. Is that why you arranged the attack? Conspired with Keves, sacrificed all those lives? Without some hardship, humans don't come together. It was just the same with you. Cut the crap! How could you put Fiona through this? I know perfectly well what I did! But Fiona, she never once gave up. She wouldn't let the dream be all there was. That purity of purpose. It lifted everybody up. The need to support one another. She taught me that as well. <sighs> oh, well, ain't that nice? Learn this! Truth. The fact is, your friends are dead, and I'm the one who can. 
Order, you know? What do you do? You've chosen multiplies the TP of all active characters except self by 120%. You kidding me? Isn't that great? Isn't that better than Teach? Shares own buffs? One random buff? She's got to regenerate the order, you see? Goodness. Alright, 
during the resistance. This isn't the end. This is the decider. You're finished. Hi, yeah. Another order coming up. Break or just go for the high crit. Just gonna go for damage since I got a feeling this shirt's gonna resist anyway. One day I'll get the hang of these chain attacks. Clearly, I'm way worse at using a shield too by now. Up this movie's experience. All right. Let's get some first blood going. Hey, hey, hey. Oh man, it's not 
That's not weird. to do. Get slapped. Oh yeah. Ooh. So charges... Yeah, charges chain attack gauge and that's power charge to all that. Charging the chain? Has that been a thing? You're able to charge it again while you're in the chain attack? I didn't even pay attention to that. What does that even look like? Totally charge the chain attack gauge again. Some just dropped off. that I can add to the chain attack gauge while in the chain attack.
I see some relations have changed. Definitely a Pharaonis. Okay. What? Was this like forming an archway earlier? This is where the flame clock was. How did we never see it before? Look, I'm not great with words, but I wanted to say, I'm sure she was a complicated person too. I'll never forgive what Ermer did. I know I can never, ever forgive her. But if I'd never met her, I wouldn't be who I am today. She's taught me a lot as well. Just... just promise you won't suffer alone, all right? If things get too much to bear, you can always talk to me. Tallow. If you need to grumble or swear or call someone names, I'm your man. I'll get rid of all your worries. You can count on this turkin head, okay? <laughs> Same old tallow. She woke me up, you know. Irma did. Made me watch you. I couldn't move, but I followed every word you said. Perhaps she didn't want you to be alone. But then, why? Why do something like that? I'm supposed to be the turkin head, not Irma. I... I want to know about these Mobius people. I have to know what Irma was thinking. Will you let me fight by your side still? No reason to say no. You're already our friend, Fifi. Don't ever forget how you're feeling right now. I think it'll keep you strong. Yeah. I won't. Not ever. Here we go! Class. Oh no. Interesting, interesting. Fiona's class. A unique healer that applies random buffs to allies and can strengthen the whole party with arts. I see some relations have changed. Very good. Good. Flame clack or no flame clack. 
make no difference for Gugu. -Goo. But also understand pain it brought. Pain of saying goodbye to many friends when life sucked away. So Gugu -Goo understand reason my friends want to destroy. Still, Gugu -Goo have no inkling that breaking was possible option. This was quite the story right here in this colony. There's Talo. Don't worry, I can take care of Colony B. I don't really know what to do yet, but I'm the only one who knows what really happened. Don't let Fiona do this all by herself. We can show her what made Arma, or what Arma left behind together. Sweet. Do we not have a hero selected right now? Interesting. It's just us few right now. actually gonna end I mean she's here in the hero selection page so she should actually end up being someone we can use I wonder if I can spoil myself as to what her deal is that would be you oh yeah she did say me so that's definitely her it's called Lost Vanguard yeah that adds up 100% Shield wool, mighty beat, thunder steel. I want the lone exile. Like, no joke. I want it real good. Actually, did anybody finish off? Lands is done. Where'd he go, Lands? Senna's like right behind him. Look at all that done. So, he just unlocked that as one of his S ranks. Soul Hacker is weird, so like, I don't even really want to be on Soul Hacker until I've reaped a bunch of souls or whatever. Cursor is not his. So, I mean, yeah, signify. Oh, yeah. Why not? Got it. So, Brent's own buffs to allies. That applies to one random buff to self. Interesting. Now that's a uh, cool attack art. These both have the same idea to them. It's a single target boost damage dealt for each active buff. And this boost damage for each active buff, but AoE. Pretty cool. Alright, so how do the skills play in for this class? Restores nearby allies HP on art execution. Amount healed is equal to 30% of users healing. Extends buff duration of buff effects issued by self by 30%. 
increases number of field arts. It can be set to the arts palette by one and restores 3% of HP when a buff is applied. So, it's trying to be interesting. It's definitely, like it says, S rank on the player difficulty. So, hmm. Oh, it says two random bluffs, buffs for the team. Take an attacker. We can Manana take care of it. Looking good, looking good. Man, that picture. <laughs> Those swords should not all be there, but they are. New hero and intense enemy battles. I hope it's more than one hero. I mean, I get it if it can't be, because the way they set it up is definitely different from Blades in 2. I get the feeling it probably was a good bit easier to add Blades than it will be to add heroes to this game. But even so... I'm just hoping. Or at least that challenge mode ends up being really engaging. I mean, even if it is two, you'll still be able to level up those two heroes very quickly and be done. So it really doesn't matter. Tool. I think you operate it like so. Ching. Time to take the fast way. This is just crazy. There's not at least a location name for this. I'll follow you. On it. Uh! Wonder what's inside. But this one's real crazy with the goods. Oh, phantom feather. This place is huge. That's some monster quest. Unspeakable being. So that is where I need to end up at. It's not letting me track them to the main story. It certainly help. Ooh, 
Is this the one? I mean, I know we were after Corn Island. Wrong. I guess it would be here, huh? By the time you dig into the island. This must be Corn Island, the place Kasame told us about. Better give it a good one, island and head to the opposite side. That'll be where Agnians keep the transport. These crabs take down that? What are these crabs made of? Did it just die naturally and they're scavenging like crabs do? Yikes. We can't just leave this be. So much to explore. A container. But it is. Find his keepers. Wonder what's inside. Looking at the sword up there is insane. Um, are we gonna be all right? With what? What happened? Huh. Huh. I was looking at the sword. Was something attacking? like that point of interest is still above here. There we go. Ah, I can see the Belena. Let's try to sneak in quietly. We don't want to be found by the Agnians. Agnians where? <laughs> Uh, what, we just ship jack in their thing? Don't mind if I do. Anyone feel like taking a break? Oof. Okay, now, how do we get closer to the Belina? You don't. That means ruffles. We got found. Wipe them out. Oh my god! 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 Oh my
You ought to try that rage amulet. I think we got a leg in. You're dealing with me. Thanks. Still only one tank to pick from here so far. I really I need, need to help. find that Lone Exile class. That way that person can tank and be a new person. He's got the Titanium Temple Guard. Woohoo! He's got sixes now? Is that, are they just kind of upgrading their gems as they go? It's kind of cool. I think that's what's happening here. You might go crazy with the tank in. Look out! Careful, everyone! Keep your sticks to physical I mean, the tanks are doing pretty okay jobs, but it's still not really enough. I wonder what I should do differently. Cruise aggro every second. Major effect. I'm quite fond of this. Okay. 
Top of launch, great crap. does not feel strong. It's so slow. Uh, is there somebody he could use? are this signifier is not nearly potent enough for anyone. Not really sure. I want to let it stay in use, but I just, I don't know, it's so weird. It's got the region field. percent of the healing power it's not a lot the healing fields only saving grace for it right now hey, you're backed out Guard. I'll take real good care of the bad guys. Zion will still be in the mix. class. It's not going to cut it. I guess he can go back to sword fighting. Leave the enemies to me. combos, unfortunately. So I guess staying as is is fine.
I already got maximum voltage down there. Pilot flurry. Seems like the best one I can pick for that. It's weird. It feels like he should have more. Master Arts, but he has been learning a lot of, you know, same area jobs, like, um, I don't know, he's got a lot of stuff learned. Feels pretty empty, kind of. Critical rate, 20%. Yes, I'm quite all right with this. Oh, he's got to figure out his accessories. has that right now. Why? Oh uh, yeah, no, that's not right. Damage dealt when attacking toppled enemies. I'm gonna be trying to break quite a bit, but so is Tyon. Who's toppling right now? Anybody? Probably not anybody. Art set. You can't because you're a war medic. A war medic can't master art that. Okay. Yeah, we're definitely gonna want some of these on. What will it be? Okay, I'm 
Fighting Spirit, I guess. Is that good? Like that's not terrible. Well, no, because it's not I mean could do this then still. Great stuff. Physical hands. Accessory to put on, no. Side damage up. Sure. I don't mind being bursty with it. If I really want to get interesting, I guess I could. Could probably put the ex taco extender on you. Yeah. We'll just go with what we got, I think. Uh oh. I think they just gave me the side eye. <laughs> Just one of those wonky spots where it's a lot of enemies and it's difficult because they just usually annihilate you before the combat even starts. Gone, 
just like that. It's been my problem for a while now. But hey, we'll figure it out. I've always figured it out so far. Without having to drop off a card now. But how are you doing, Eevee? Are you doing well? It's okay if you're not, but hopefully you're doing well. <laughs> okay. tell you so it's not a rushed last minute thing. Gotcha, gotcha, makes sense. Glad you at least have a game plan. But, like, I'm having a hard time even targeting them. Did you win? <laughs> yeah, that would be your fault. Totally. Can't say you didn't try. Healers 
this out is, which is not good at all. I can try target the healer I'm in front of. It's getting troublesome. If I could move faster by targeting what I need to target, that would help a lot. Actually, let me try classic targeting then. Because it is not cooperating. Oh shoot, I can't do that here. That's really annoying. Okay, I guess I'll just figure it out. Nope. Not really. Definitely not big enough. You've got to focus the healer. Especially if you want everybody else attacking. I can't get everybody else attacking without physically targeting the enemy healers. with the big guys hitting me hard. Yeah, it's a little bit of everything. Honestly, I think it's the reinforcements that are the problem. Because I'd be totally fine. Otherwise, we'll put her on this healer, because Mio works way better as this healer. Just way better for her. She's very good on this one. They each like kind of have predispositions. Of course, they can like slay out on any class that you know you want them on. But like uh, this is her S rank healer compared to that which was just her A rank healer. It's not big difference, but this one's just really good in general. So try mixing her up with this. Yep. Well, I don't know. Do you have an evade? I don't think you have any evade master arts. doesn't belong here. Boom. Absolutely better. That'll do.
put some accessories on it. basic stuff for the moment because it shouldn't take anything too special wherever the other healing stuff is yeah keep the aggro off of it real good Her healing arts healing. Woo! That should help out. Look out! Careful, everyone! You're dealing with me! You're a lifesaver! I can always count on you, Theon! I've lost the enemy! No! Everyone's left! Keep the Oh, cool. See the game where the tanks really need to turn the enemies like away from everybody, but they don't do that. It's kind of bad for us. Honestly, I'd love it if they stop interlinking too. Like, I know they're doing it to save themselves because we're taking damage so quickly, but we're better on foot than interlinked right now. Just to start the fight off. This one's gonna come. like them doing it, being able to do it on their own sometimes, because it's nice for seamless combos. Because if they know to prioritize combos, it's nice letting them do it on their own. But the annoying thing is, is you can't even go into that settings menu unless you back out of the fight. And I don't want to back out now, because I'm already here. But like, I, if I could just hit the B button and go back to that main menu instead of the character menu, I'd be able to go in the settings and do the uh, targeting system I think might help, and I'd be able to take over their interlinking, but I can't do that from here unless I back way out, which is not really going to be a huge difference, but... I'm just being stubborn now that I'm here, pretty much. Oh, this 
Six Serious. You're dealing with me. You're a lifesaver. <laughs> 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 They're getting the healers immediately. I can't work with that. I've got all the stuff I can do to keep the aggro off of the healers, but they're still getting annihilated. By AoE, I guess. I don't know. Oh, absolutely no preventing that. I wish. That would be great. Because <sighs> hmm. I can't top a lock enough of them. Got a healer here, let's get rid of it. Shadow is gone. That one. The healers are gone. Now we can take anybody out of our leisure. So long as we live through it. Yo. You're just stuck here, Neo. Target. No, I tried so hard to dodge just then. And get me out. Uh, If you want to see what I'm doing, I'm playing this game on hard mode, and not that I play many games on hard mode, but I feel like this has to be the hardest game I've played on hard that I can remember. But uh, sure, I can try to do some sensei type stuff here, but I am getting my butt kicked at this moment. The sheer amount of ads and lack of 
good movement. Okay, so let's just back out. Oh, thank. Oh, perfect. I did cheese it. Never mind. I could have really hit that button and been fine. I didn't realize I got this waypoint. I thought the cutscene stopped me from getting it, but I totally got this waypoint and lost no progress. So I could have done this and been fine. So, what we're going to do is go into game, do targeting controls classic. Interlink control type is this. That way I can control who interlinks and who doesn't. Did I confirm that? Or did I say no? Classic party. Okay, cool. So I've only used this interlinking type once. So. So this targeting mode that I picked out of the systems menu lets you use the right bumper to target your nearest enemy, while the left bumper will toggle through all of them. And it's kind of helpful in moments like this, but I'm so used to being able to like just do the default one. That's all I've ever had in Xenoblade, or ever used at least, so the classic one, even though it's better in certain cases, I'm just used to the default. So I'm not good at groups. Groups are very hard on hard difficulty. This one's gonna be tough. I might have to use the tank myself because the fact that AoEs are just wiping us out and the tanks aren't keeping that from happening is a shame. 
So, a tank I'll be then. And hope for the best. Look out! Careful, everyone! There's a healer. Dang. Another sun is having. This is a lot of ether damage. I have to switch to type of tank I'm using too. Okay. Party's getting launched and everything. much control over this fight anyway. Okay. I've got to come up with a crazy amount of strategy for this because this is not working at all. What I desperately want is to find out where in the world this tank is. It seems like I'm skipping over it because I've unlocked this person, unlocked this person and this person. And this person's like kind of in progress. I think I can go get this tank if I wanted to. But I, judging by those names, of those moves, I desperately want this tank. This tank should be insanely strong. <clears throat> so maybe I'll go backwards for a while. We've got this checkpoint right here for our main story stuff. Huh, we're here at Shoshil's request. Do you have a stone for it? Ah, that time has come. Hmm? Uh, where is stone of mine gone? Cannot remember. We're supposed to be collecting them for. Ah, uh, Hazy Dazzy. Only have redstone, but have forgotten meaning behind it. Friends happy to take anyway. As long as it's a stone, the particulars are unimportant. She'll, she'll must be real busy if ask help from human people. There are some scaredy pond like Memo Memo out there, so keep some peeled eyes handy. We will. Always nice to have more friends. Alright. Back to letting them work on the classes they were on. Leave the enemies to me. Yo, finish this off soon. Let's put Senna back on whatever she was working on. Huh? Huh. Was it? Guess it was a sword fight? I'll knock him down. Well, it shouldn't have been. But hey. 
I'll take it. DLC outfits. Purple ain't bad. Yep, that's absolutely a hero quest, so we can go get her tank. Which probably wouldn't be something to object to. But I need to backtrack, because I've definitely missed a tank. And it's the one I want the most. So, don't know how. Don't know how I messed that up. But I do need to fix it, that's for sure. Completed. Besides this one. Boost accuracy during the night by 55%. That's a pretty popular item right there. one hero quest we have here. Reminder, Drifter Cousin, I am deep in the game, so if you're worried about spoilers, probably not. Great, I can try to go places that aren't too hope bad. Everyone's getting along. But there's some spoilers. Oh hey, perfect timing. You lot have already smashed up a few flame flocks so far, right? Yeah, a few, I guess. Why? Well, the thing is, the lost numbers are going to start paying out a bounty for damage dealt to Mobius. Here you go. Oh. Sure. Always nice to have more friends. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. I'll I'll take free stuff anytime. Ah, so you showed up. Are we getting more of that bounty? Yeah. You have really done in quite a few of those flame flocks now, huh? The fighting is only going to get more fierce from now on. I hope you'll be helping us with that crystal ear when you heck yeah. Gondor is the only one who knows the whereabouts of the real queens. I really hope that everything works out. You don't think we can handle it? No, no. It's got nothing to do with you guys or the plan. Sorry, just forget I thought anything at all. The boss will, the boss will have my guts for garters if I say something I'm not supposed to. Alright, you... Monica, can we talk? What's up? Sounds ominous. We were hoping we could ask you about someone. Guernica, in fact. About Dad? Everyone in the city speaks so highly of him. But we still don't know a whole lot about him. I think we owe him that much. All right. Where do you want to start? You were brought up by him, right? So, we thought you'd probably understand him better than anyone else. Ha! <laughs> I wish that were the case. The Guernica Van Damme that I knew was a man that I always looked up to. He was always busy keeping the city together or fighting out on the front line. Always distant. 
After I chose a military life, he didn't even talk to me like a parent anymore. You mean you weren't on very good terms? I got to know the man, I think, but not the father. I just thought that we'd have more time together. Huh. Yes, belts. Lots and lots of belts. Hey, boss. You're making the kids feel guilty. <sighs> Sorry. I don't blame you guys for any of this. Dad, Guernica, died in the line of duty, trying to accomplish his aim. But that's not all. He died fighting for what he believed in, and he saw it through. Of that much, I'm sure. For what he believed in? Well, about that, there still might be a bit of unfinished business there. He sure was adamant about getting stuff home to people. Yeah, for certain. Sorry, what do you mean exactly? Personal effects from the deceased. Things that family and friends can remember them by. We don't leave any other mark behind that says we were here, you see? If there are people waiting for you, then you just want to leave something behind, whatever it may be. I was in the rear guard. I know just how dangerous that battlefield was. Maybe it's better not to dwell on that. Hmm. But there are personal items that have been left behind, though, right? Huh? Maybe you'd let us do something to help out with that. It must be really painful for the people who never got the chance for closure. Yeah, right? I'm starting to get a handle on how they see things in the city. Sort of. But if there's something we can do about it, I want to try to help. I appreciate the sentiment, guys. But why go to all this trouble? Well, we'll get some closure from doing this too. We were losing friends every day. And before we became Uroboros, some of us used to be offseers. Gernica went to all that trouble for others. And when it happened, he was thinking of everyone waiting for him in the city. So I'd like to help his voice find its way. Hmm. Much appreciated. Speaking personally, good on you. Travis, could you pull up the tactical register? Roger that. Give me a moment. There's the data. We've got a list of deceased soldiers and the likely locations where they fell. Could you check out the waypoints around Alfeso Valley? That's some impressive precision. Kind of you to notice. See, that's the thing about us lost numbers. We just don't know when to quit. <laughs> okay, guys. It's up to you now. When you're done, could you meet me at the Remembrance Stones? Got it. You have my word. Interesting. I'm gonna make it happen. I hope everyone's getting along. I wanna go here now. It's a way out of here. Just elevator. Clearly a quest right there. This goes here, that goes there. I'm gonna end up on her. All under control. Hey, they all got on. Wait. Yeah, no. no. We wait. Ooh, okay. Doesn't always go that smoothly. Not that it matters, but just 
goofy AI. Yeah. Now where is this? Up, down, all around. Guess I'll figure it out eventually. Right, gotta do it like this. It's not so good. Why are there high level robots here? I don't want to deal with all that. <laughs> that smarts. Bruh. Why does it say they're all dazed? I don't want to do this, but you're in our way. Out of my way. Weapon up that fleet was a good idea. It means there were no holes in my structure. This is a long way from the battlefield. I guess that's why no one can find you. Well, we'll get your things back to the city. Don't worry. the girl. Yeah, I guess they were hidden away so they wouldn't get damaged. I'll get your stuff back to the city for you. Not to worry, just stick to the plan. Here, I'll take you off. have a lot of nerve. This is a really long way from where the Levinus has crashed. Don't worry, we'll bring your belong back to the city. I think I need to beat up those robots though for a quest. Well, we've been found. I don't care about y'all, leave me alone. I'm fighting your robot right now. I don't want to do this, but you're in our way. I'm ready. Let's do it. Oh, crazy. Go. Someone's needy. Uh, I lost her attention. I lost her attention. Go. Rank 
Can I? Head on to the Remembrance Stones, eh? I don't want to do this, but you're in our way. I'm ready. Let's do it. Yeah. Someone's I'm so quickly. Guess everybody can just catch a piece. Class coming up. I had some lunch earlier, but I still feel like I'm oddly hungry. I normally don't eat much, so I'm not really sure how to feel about that. Brought their belongings. Thanks. Means a lot. Can you lay them out here? Now you mention it, didn't Monica put an eye patch here? Yeah, that was Guernica's. What does it mean exactly? Placing people's belongings here? How can I explain it? Um, you guys have off-seeing, right? I guess this is our version of that. Off-seeing for city folk? Hmm. You got here first. Boss, we were waiting for you. Thanks to you, these people got a chance to say farewell to their loved ones. And I got to fulfill Dad's dying wish. Thank you.
just sacrifices. They've entrusted us all with the future. As the Founders did, looking back is not an option. This game in its feels. Huh. So that was enough seeing. The sound of that music, it's really something else. I don't think anyone here will forget this day as long as they live. The Fallen never got to win their battles, but maybe now they can get some rest. Yeah, finally. Speaking of, you ought to get some rest too. You're going to be pretty busy from now on. You said it, boss. Wait, wait just how busy are we talking here? From now on, I'll be traveling with Noah's crew. Hmm. Huh? But then who's gonna handle things in the city? You'll be here, won't you, Travis? Uh, like father, like daughter, eh? <laughs> Dad spent his life on the front line, and I want to carry on that tradition. I understood that when I heard the Offseer's play. It has to be me. I have to carry on his legacy, fulfill his hopes. I'll fight for you now. Call on me any time you need my help. Thank you. That's truly heartening. I hope we'll get to know each other outside of battle too. There's so much I'd like to ask you about yourself, the city. My worries. A word of warning, guys. The boss's stories are long. If you've got time to rip on the boss, I might just assign you some more duties. <laughs> oh. Well, at least I won't have to worry about the city while I'm gone. Just holler if you need me. We'll take you up on that. Woohoo. Always nice getting a new hero added. The battle for the future is here, and we're on the front line. This is a hard one to guess. I feel like Noah and Mia both were kind of like connecting with her on that one. I feel like Mia really spoke out at the end there, so I'm gonna guess Mia's the class inheritor. Uni? What? Wow, usually through the quest and dialogue you can tell who's gonna get the class, but that was unexpected. Uni? Interesting. So, the Lost Vanguard is a defender. 
that protects allies by deploying fields. Uh, specializes in countering enemy attacks and can deal damage while guarding. Hold on a minute. Uni got that. That was surprising. They finally pulled a real fast one on me. Is autonomy. And now we know things. I see some relations have changed. Hey, I just heard Monica's going to go with you to the front, right? She must be brave to take that step. I don't know if I have it within me to make a decision like that. Sorry about that. Mother was asking me a question. But I'm back to reading. You read this right. She must be brave to take a step. Take that step. I don't know if I have it in me to make a decision like that. <sighs> Granica never made it back, and neither did you. But that's the thing about fighters. When they come up against something scary, they can't just pretend they didn't see it. I'm sorry, I didn't mean to pile more worry on you like that. Just hold on to your lives. Nothing more important after all. So now I'm going to use the map to see where I might not have gone. Just about traveled most of what we have to explore. So what am I looking for? Is it 
the path comes out of it. Well, not the lower. Just here. Could quite possibly be a colony somewhere around here. There's a lot of area there. Let's check it. At least Uni will have a new tank. That'll be good. I swear I've missed this. One tank I really want, though. Not really sure how I managed that. So if I'm gonna go from here, we'll turn around. Are we on the right side of the zip line or? No, we're not on the right side. So what can I do then? Oh, colony land over there and stuff. Could try here. Cause there was a lot of exploring to do up the water fountain or waterfall. This is Feels like this is probably not the best guess because Colony Lambda is right here. So I have a hard time believing there'd be an aggressive colony up ahead, but we'll see. <gasps> Watch your footing, guys. Up we go. There is a lot of area to explore here, for sure. Such a weird mid-ground of swimming and not swimming. And then I need to gather stuff so I can craft my gems up because they're clearly behind. There's a lot to do in this game, that is for sure, and they will be adding more with an expansion pass, which is just insane to me. I hope we can make use of this. Actually, I don't know. Was did they say it was a colony near the castle? I think I actually might need to go to the castle. I'll be using this. I think I took one of their storylines. Is this was an unpassable spot at the time? But I think it was actually them saying there's a colony this way, and we probably shouldn't bother with it. But when they say shouldn't like that, it actually probably meant I should bother with it. That smarts. Huh. 
Good thing we found this. So I got a feeling that's where I'm going to be heading next. I might try to wipe that stuff out though. They are on par with my level though, which is scary. Here we go, guys. Acknowledged. Assuming combat position. I'll take them on. You're a lifesaver. Monica, no, you're a tank. What are you doing? I'll get you up in a set. You hurt me, Tyler. Line down, wait. There's the tanks. These are the. Losing fight. They'll probably all show back up again. Which is lame. Love to just be able to whittle down their numbers. But you know. You've got to have something, I guess. I don't know. Alright. Oh, that's a Piranha's Hulk. Yeah, that's kind of sick. Topographical info update. First cataract. A Cascade Hulk. I absolutely do not mind if I do. Well, I gotta fight these. Don't try to stop us. I don't think we'll run into any issues. Cool. I'm I'm it most. You're a lifesaver. Mystic fish. Moving in sync, right, Tile? Don't try to stop us. I'm so ready for this. Oreo! I'll take them on. You're a lifesaver. More fish to beat. Don't try to stop us. Leave it to me. I'll have them crying by the end. 
Still? I can't hit a fish with a bow from here? Are you kidding me? This is the most short range bow ever. Off out of it. Too easy. Come after me, and that's what you get. I'm hoping somebody else is quicker with the bow. I mean, I say that, but I'm even, not even really that sure if it's like a great flash or not yet. fish in the water. It's just crazy. That was pretty much what I expected. I'd say we were moving in sync. Right, Tile? Some of this ether, up, thank goodness. Let's use this. Could you help me out here? On it. Here we go. <sighs> oh, yeah. Strong. Please do power this bad boy up. That's not even enough either. I needed to put more in there. I'm way too loaded up on ether, y'all. Rebooted. Got aggro. What this? No window shopping. Uh, do you know Chef Shell? We Chef Shell not like hard work, so send human to Agro. Agro. De. Take this and bye bye. Oh, okay. Um, thank you. At least it's not Papana. Papana think you too clever by half. I, uh, anyway, a friend is not customer, 
then kindly make like tree and get out. Good to add more make names. like tree. Did I read that right? Make like a tree and get out. Anything to help our cause. Is this like a rare thing? Anything to help our cause. Yes. Too cheap. What do you think I am, machine broke? You think I ain't got money? You don't want my money? Off? That was a good way to take care of that quest, though. That's for sure. Indeed it is. Did friends clear out monsters haunting smelly old Firanis? Yeah, that was us. What of it? Agoro, only want to offer thanks. Perhaps some non pawns not so bad after all. We've got this waypoint. Um, this isn't the land for what I want to see. It's going to be here. I think that there might have been a colony. Let's see. Because I could have totally done this in order, but I took the character lines as, no, don't go there. And there was a horrifying robot, so I was all like, I won't go there. That wasn't it. Oops, they found us. Uh, it's going to fight us. Go! Uh, it's so hard to cancel this because it feels like it takes forever. Just because you're a robot, you don't have to bleed when I use bleed status effect on you? Oh. Mio! I'm so proud of you, Mio. She is done. What will be next? The tank? I'll keep us safe from harm. Excited for Unity to be done now that she's got a um, new class to learn. There was literally a question mark back there and everything, and I just ignored it. Well, now, ain't that I think it's still insanely strong, though. So maybe I'm not meant to come here in order. Look out! Careful, everyone! But I am quite sure this is the colony. I mean, I don't know. Can we even beat Hornbow Dante? Keep your heads or lose them. I'm ready. Let's do it. 
I do not like this bow. I can't, it doesn't even have more range. It's really hard to cancel a parry with a long to me. It's definitely not for me, at the very least. all these locations while I'm here. Let's see if there's any other tricks to it. Maybe I'll find a rough spot while we're here. Find a rough spot I can usually level up pretty hard. I'll probably be level 60 by the time I'm done with that. I hope we can make use of this. Maybe a side fault. Such is the Offseer's duty. Every day's a training day. Huh? Hey, did you guys hear something? I don't know. Did we? You're asking the hard questions. So if I really want to slap that robot around, I'm going to need to go get my levels out of the resting experience spot. Monica, what are you doing? And Vladi is going to be one of the chain attacks because he goes crazy against machines. This is Noah's like S rank class to be using, but I am just not resonating with it at all. It's good to keep just a record. Want to get it out of the way. There, I'm just 
gonna be done with that. Thankfully. Strong. What the heck? Deal 150% more and take 25% less damage while in a field effect? Yo. gonna go in as a Iron class actually. It's kinda interesting. Once you're done with the ogre, you'll be able to work on this, which will be great. spot. Jeez. It's never going to stop being insane to me. Hopefully I can make some gems, but probably not since I haven't been looking for the supplies and items I need. Going backwards. Better make sure we're well rested. Level 60. I'm gonna need I that. I feel stronger. I'll be making the crazy stuff. I still haven't even figured out where that Kramit device fragment comes from, though. 
There's a lot I gotta figure out. Can make that. Looks good to me. I think we'll find this useful. Another gem's done. I think we'll find this useful. Shot Gyok tail. Gem's done. I think we'll find this useful. Gem's done. I think we'll find this useful. Cured Armory Sirloin that I remembered getting, but then it disappeared. Need it there, too. I'm eager to run some tests. What are the not pond recipes looking like now? Let me drop loose collectible enemy stuff. I want to see like class point boosts. It's like the best class point booster there is. This is quite the scenario. Gotta love it. It's good to keep a record. Personal hygiene is every soldier's duty. <sighs> Golden like that. Doesn't that usually mean. Okay, I need to check on that. Can I keep my brain in order? Gotta keep nice and limber. Let's make the most of our break, guys. Now, I'm very curious about this. It's a golden quest. Let's lay out the facts. Seems that they believe in fortune clovers in the city as well. What can I say? If you know, you know. <laughs> and if you know, you're going to want to collect them. Isn't it mysterious? Seeing children talk about things never fails to bring a smile. Oh yeah, it is mostly co children collecting them, 
That's right. You got a point to make, Santa Love. Oops, uh, no, no, not really. <laughs> you want to go join the city brats, uni? Sounds like you have a lot in common. <laughs> oh, oh, you absolute muppet. Come on, uni, no need to get all worked up. Queen, this lace is you lot. Let a girl have her hobbies, will ya? That's right. If they grow near the city as well, then they could have a little excursion someday. Or we could have a little excursion someday. You're the only one here I can trust, Noah. Noah! Hey! How's tricks? We're doing fine here, Boliaris. And you? Ah, uh, same old, same old. Though we're not getting any provisions from home, so our supply guys are being run ragged. Any requests for us? I don't imagine you called just to shoot the breeze. <laughs> no. Good point. Got a bit of info to share with you. Yeah? Specifically, it's about Colony 5. Colony 5? I think... I remember something about them being pretty highly ranked. Yeah. We only happened to hear by chance, but apparently they made gold just the other day. Or so it seems, but we're not sure. Oh, go on. Last time a colony went gold? I think it was about 40 years ago. When you go gold, you're pardoned from fighting. That's why everybody busts their balls trying to rank up. That sounds pretty familiar. Thing is, we're not even hearing a peep about this from the other colonies. It's as if they're acting like Colony 5 never existed to start with. I've tried getting in direct contact with them, but I haven't heard a fart back. You think something happened? Well, the woman in charge of Colony 5, or Solia, was close friends with our commander. With Athor? To give you some background, some two years after the commander got us to Silver, well, Solia managed it as well. Kamaravi might have been Ethel's rival, but Osolia and Ethel, they were sworn friends. What, so if it wasn't for the thing with Kamaravi, you all would have made it to gold rank? Eh, I guess you could say it was likely. Then I can see why you'd be worried. Yep. so I was thinking of going to take a look. Been six days since we lost contact. If there's been some accident, we could still be able to help. Are you sure that's a good idea? You've got no flame clocks. What if you end up like us? We'll get the spark out of there before that happens. But I'm talking about Osolia here. I ain't just gonna leave her. And if the commander was here, she'd do the exact same thing. I, I really want to help out on this. Whoa. Uni. Seems out of the blue. Well, you see... What the... Why didn't you tell us this sooner? Gotta share this stuff. Sorry. I just didn't really believe it. So, what you're saying is... You think that in the past, you were attached to a gold rank colony? Could be. This ain't some ash about wanting to know my past self or anything. A whole colony just fell to pieces. I have to know why. You reckon Mobius have something to do with it? With what I saw, definitely. So that's why. All right. We'll help you out. No, uh, I mean, are you sure? You know, I'd be glad for the help here, sure, but I really wouldn't want... Oh, enough of this already. Tell me this isn't exactly what you were hoping for. <laughs> Saw through my clever ruse, eh? Must be losing my touch. <laughs> I've seen that memory too, when interlinking with uni. And I guarantee you it was not a dream. I'm certain of it. True. I feel the same. What do you two think? No objections. Let's head out. Yeah. I want to lend a hand as well. 
There you go. Okay? Ah, I owe you one, mate. Seems like I'm always getting you in trouble. It's fine, Boliaris. We do have an obligation here, right? Man, not to forget all that food you gave us. Oh, yeah, I remember you took seconds. Righto. I'll be moving out after this. Let's rendezvous around here. The Orion Trail. Understood. We'll give our stuff a once over, then get going. All right. See you there. Yeah. See you. Noah? Friends make journey to Goldie Colony? Yep. That's the plan. Then, humbly asking to drag Manana along. No problem. But why? Manana heard rumorings. Say that Goldie Colonies have super real good ingredients lying around. Manana will take these ingredients. Resulting dishes will blow both socks and minds. Trying to expand the old repertoire. Eh, Manana? Expand! That'd be really great, actually. Okay. Don't know why I'd ever refuse. Manana, <laughs> if you're going... Rikugo. Naturalistic. Only answer is yes. I just said I won't refuse. We can all go. Uni-side story, huh? Interesting. So we're gonna level her up, I bet. Huh. It's so very huh. random how that comes about. I mean, it's fortune clovers in Uni, so I guess that's fair. But still, it just came from here in the city and overhearing oh was it talk about fortune clovers or watching the kids enjoy fortune clovers Hey there, you lot. Fast as a spark in Rogel. Well, we would hate to keep you waiting. Good man. So where's Colony 5? Easy. It's up on the Losca Plateau. Should see it once you've cleared the cave. Mm. What are we waiting for, then? This bloody murk's giving me the creeps. Uni should cool jets. Guessing in tiz won't help. <laughs> You'll be in a tiz in a minute. All he's saying is that we should play it safe. Careful. Right? Correct. Especially if situation involve Mobius creeps. All right. I am actually trying to control myself. If I start going crazy, nudge me. Whoa. Where's the real uni? I just don't want us dragging our feet, all right? <laughs> Here we go. Better give it a good once over. Is this like a 
rare thing? I wonder if I could have found Colony 5 early. That would have been cool. I should have tried. Colony 5 should be just past here, huh? Looks that way. Defenses look a bit tighter than at Lambda. Huh. I'll claim the ether here. Finally, a normal amount of ether. Oh my. That's this not a good sign. Leave this be. We've got to be super cautious around here. Yeah, sparks, but I've got a bad feeling about this. We can't just leave this be. I'll do my best. We can't leave it like this. Considering their elevation, it can only be... Right. Only something as big as Ura, Boris, or Mobius could make these. Right? Ethel's man. From Colony 4. Yeah, that's right. Then you guys... You couldn't be... Couldn't be what? No, can't be. You aren't friends with that monster, are you? With what monster? Thank the flames. Huh? It happened so fast. First the commander was promoted to gold, and the night after that, that thing came. 
You could tell it wasn't Agnian. Nothing native to these parts could tell at a glance. It was cackling. Having fun cutting our friends to shreds. <laughs> It'd be Mobius. Has to be. Yes, but why attack Colony 5? And we came to find that out, right? Think. Must be a reason. And the colony? How's Osolia? No clue. We were in such a hurry to save our skin. Scrambling for a place to hide. Then you guys showed up. Right. Well, she can't be all that far off. Shall we? Spark, yeah. And if any Mobius mudders are there, we mess them up. Yeah. Looking at these guys, they don't seem under Mobius' control. But that makes them targets we need to protect. No argument there. Who are you guys? You're working with Agnes. Once we're done here, I'll tell you all you want to know. It'll blow your mind. Okay. Let's get a move on, eh? Before we do, we should escort these guys somewhere safe. Some of them are wounded. Ah, too true. Definitely don't want them in combat. How about the cave entrance? They'll be safe as castles. Cave entrance, huh? Yeah, that'll work. I, um... We owe you. They are zooming. Um, these weren't here before, were they? No, they weren't. Have they been drawn by the husks, maybe? Is this, like, a rare thing? Let's sort this mess out. Stay as a group. That's what happened here. We're almost out. Dang, got it. Yeah, once we get out of here, we should be safe for a while. Gotta go get the rest now. Be more careful to get them all. All right, you too. I'll sit tight here. We'll press on to Colony 5. Thanks. It's really us who should be going, but... How can we ever thank you? These guys are doing all the fighting. Thank them. I'm just along for the ride. Oh, cheers. Ah, <laughs> oh, come on. Anyway, you just leave finding Orsolia to us.
Oh boy. This is gonna be some crazy stuff here. We should level up our um, Lantern Link. Soul Tree might have some room to level. Powder Pearl, Nail Stone. I'm sure those are great items. Like so. This is something decent, right? Peon stone. <sighs> Nothing good's gonna come of this. We better prepare for the worst. Let's just hurry. It's too soon to assume the worst. Uh oh! Trouble come with our name on it! What sucking hell was? in the whole cave. Are you kidding me? That's yeah, really dumb. I wish it made sense to me how in the world tanking works sometimes because I was just not getting aggro.
Uh, I guess we won't do that again since that was horrific. Never seen this place before. The flame clock. It's still glowing. Oh no. Almost empty. There... really can't be a lot of soldiers left. You killed her. I wish I'd known you were paying a visit. I'd have found a much more practical use for this thing. Y you're... <laughs> you can call me X. And this is... Well... He's just some underling, so I don't actually care. Anyway, I count myself lucky. I mean, you popping up while we render judgment. A judgment, is it? Oh! Did they actually work it out? Work it out? Oh, what? You didn't? Way to get my hopes up. I thought you came because you worked out what's going on with the colony ranks. With the ranks? Yes, the ranks. You've been so desperate to raise them. Just for a bit of comfort, you snatched away the lives of your enemies. Are you gonna get to your point? Come on! Oh! Are you some kind of idiot? I mean, I've laid it all out for you. Just think a minute, it'll come to you. Snuff off! Oh. I'll make it so you dopes can understand. Are you ready? Taking notes? It was us who made up all the colony ranks. Good old Mobius. <gasps> what? First we have the lowly dirt, then there's tin. Tins go up to copper. Then you get iron. After that comes steel. Then you get the badass silver. And finally... You've hit the top gold. Other, trying to kill each other day by day. <sighs> but why? What did you even make the ranks for? Because what else is gonna motivate you, eh? What? You humans, you need some kind of goal in your little lives. You wanna give your blades an upgrade? You wanna eat some nice food? Or you wanna live longer? You evil! All we did was give you those goals. And while you're trying to rise up, your life force grows brighter! So shiny! Isn't it wonderful? But then, once you've reached the top, there's nowhere to go but down. And that's no good, is it? Then it's harvest time! One last gasp of defiance! Then we take what's stored up at your life's end. So then, you're saying the gold rank's nothing but a sham? I just told you, it's to motivate you. Oh yeah, you motivated us real good. You forced us to fight without ever knowing the truth. Huh? What are you even... You've done a good job tearing the place up yourselves. Nobody's ever forced you to do anything. 
You guys, you like a spot of murder as much as anyone. There's nothing to like about it. How could anyone like it? We live in fear, knowing nothing but fighting. We wanted to reach gold so we wouldn't have to fight. But you... You took even that from us. Because you're idiots, surely. Just think about it real hard for one second. Who gave up the right to think for themselves? You did. What a load of crap! You're the ones who never left us any room to think about our actions! You haven't got two neurons in your heads. All you have are the things we gave you. And you have the gall to complain? <laughs> Arsehole! You ain't getting away with this! How can our lives mean so snuffing little to you? Uni! She just goading Uni to make feathers ruffled. Keep it frosty! But she's... False. She's scared of Ouroboros. She won't mistake making so she can give friend the finisher. You think she's... scared? You! Smart cookie, aren't you? I was told Nopon aren't supposed to interfere. Maybe they were wrong. Well, whatever. It messes up my plans just a little. But I think it's about harvest time. I'll take every last spark. New colony entries have been registered. need her weapon one of these days, just so we're clear on that. Maybe not today, maybe not tomorrow, but it's gotta happen soon. Okay, who's gonna be the healer? Oh my. Forty percent chance to evade ranged attacks. Good to go. I can take care of support. Hopefully, War Medical cut it. This is going to be intense.
I don't know if I'm doing the right thing by fighting the Mobius part. Summon Junior Trions or Bless. We got a break. We're getting a topple. right now heavily there's blood kick it into healing mode not that that helps us a lot which one's the better Subjugation. Do you think this plan might work? You didn't. Looking good. I'm with you. Cutting them up. This should be strong. Any last words? Ha! 
power. Grand design. Everybody's got like some sort of burst sitting around, do they? I need to find more arts with burst combo enders. That would be fun. Quite a bit of fun. Shared nothing with anyone, unfortunately. Just got them in the party. I could have chain attacked again. Ah! Tag on it. We were close to getting rid of him. wasn't bad, so just got to play more carefully next time. Throat. 
That didn't sound pretty. Boost damage dealt outdoors. Those are cool. Allows reviving allies even when not in the, hem the healer role. Wow. I'm quite fond of this. We'll keep in mind that we got that. Master Arts will be fully charged when starting the battles. Heck yeah. I'm Build quite fond of attack this. on art execution. We got some strong stuff. Inner light level build up. I'm quite fond of this. Definitely want that on. Seemed like it was going quite well to fight the Mervius first. She's gonna be healthy, she's not gonna be official. Alright, not go staying out in the hurt, please. the circle of healing. I know it's kind of been short. Oh, I meant to do the cancel one. I'm being done. Actually, would it have multiplied up enough because of Riku and Banana?
nice. Yeah. That kind of stuff. Um, do we just go right for it, or do we try to put in some more effort? I'm too nervous. I just want to keep it nice and straightforward. <laughs> she discovered her location for us because she clipped outside of the area. Oh, that's funny. break now. This isn't the end. I use my thinking muscles for this one. Ah, we got no uh let's see. I don't know that I need their order, but Yeah, 
crafted yet. Looks like it's gonna be in the end. Let's make this happen. Bravo. Alright, we're Boris, order. It is active. Great. She'll probably send it over, so let's make sure we do it. Very odd in chain attack since it's not like actually getting the chance to heal. Um, do I wanna go well over or Got. She was ready. Everything's hitting. Whoa. Let's see what this does. A lot of damage, that's what. 530. God dang. For trying to heal. And then I just dropped right there. Dang, gone. Ah, it was so close to being down. Just because I went to revive uni. Ah, gosh darn it. I didn't check the aggro lines, I guess. Dang on it. Healing? I don't know how good that is, or isn't. Uh, 
I don't even think it's necessarily Noah who's doing a bad job healing. I feel like it's... Oh. Oh, did I never... Oh, please tell me they weren't... Like, without those. I sure hope those were, like, accounted for. Field damage dealt. What the fields being placed do damage? Is that what I? Oh wait, no, they do. They have damage fields. Duh. <laughs> Very impressive. You're like not bad at all. Still makes me laugh. I was so close to reviving him, all I had to do was get him! <sighs> Dang, gone it! He shouldn't even be this out fast! soon. That's either a play on the rebirth process or they just freaking made this meta out of nowhere. <sighs> Why don't you have a last accessory? to sit here and sell a bunch of these so I know how to find my stuff easily enough. Eventually I'll just be able to like focus getting the very best accessories in the game and having like you know maybe three at a time of each of the best ones so I don't have all of this like eraser and then 
you know, eraser minor, eraser common. Like, I'm not gonna be able to manage all that. resistance stuff
guess I need to do Too good, actually. Leave it to uni. It would be magical if they can, some reason, get this. I guess that'll be bringing me back in because I did just do it That is a weak kill. Somebody. Not sure who it's gonna end up being. It's gonna be somebody.
getting somewhere. Oh. Where we're getting. How about something like this? You It's not slapping me. And all. Cheers for the compliment, but I'll tell you one thing. I ain't doing this because I like it. I'm just doing this to survive. You don't change. You're still just a grunt. You're desperate to kill just because you're afraid of dying. That's where you're wrong. This isn't just for me anymore. A lot of people's hopes are riding on this. So the now, I ain't afraid. I'll carry these hopes as far as I can. Until we've made the world how it should be. Oh? Well said. Alright. How far can you take this? Guess I'll wait and see. Oh, look! Just can't wait to escape, can you? <laughs> well, of course. I'm a busy girl, after all. Can't spend all my time playing with you. Bye bye <laughs> What's it all been for, eh? All of our fighting. We struggle on and on. But at the end of the day, it never ends. As long as we live, all we can do is fight on. That's not going to change. You're saying there's no escape? Depends how you look at it. Sourcing ingredients and growing crops. You'd call doing those things a struggle, wouldn't you? <laughs> you say some weird stuff. Fight, struggle, they're just words. And what's important is not the words, it's what you do. In it. 
What's inside's the most important thing. You know, I think I'm starting to get it. I've got you, Ethel, and all the others to thank for it. So, you're not afraid anymore, then? We're the same as everyone else. We're not perfect. Even now, we still feel fear from moment to moment. And still, you'll go on. Yeah. We want to make sure we'll... walk the path we want to. Just like Ethel once did. No matter where it goes, right? <laughs> yeah, boy. Ah, uh, class rank limit broken. The rank cap for this class is now lifted. Class rank can now reach a level 20. Whoa! Ooh. Ah, her soul is Something so bad over here. It shouldn't have fallen far. Let's try looking. Huh. Now that was some good progress, guys. I'll clean guys the and here. gals. We are going to be feeling some strong after that. <laughs> We can't just leave this be. I think I was in that fight for a while. I hope y'all don't mind if I take a bathroom break after I go get the supply crate. Because I think that's what I'm going to need to do. on me out. Who did that crap? How many times do I have to tell these people to stop messing with my cat girl? It's not that I lift, therefore I win. Alright, open this up. I'll need a hand here. I'm on it. Heck yeah. Huh. We did it. Okay. I must take a bathroom break. I won't be long though. See you guys in a moment.
just like that, I'm back. So, how's everybody doing? Oh, that was a much needed break. I almost wonder if I should let it go on a little longer so everybody can have their own breaks and grab their own food stuffs and whatnot. Oh yeah, I need to start remembering to run an ad whenever I take a break. Because I think that as long as I'm kind of placing the ads where I want them to be, it'll stop pre-rolls from happening so people don't join the stream and then they're cursed with an ad. Do I even have that button set up? Snooze at. trying to do good. Boost damage dealt by 22% when your HP is at 30% or lower. Oh, good for uni though. Thank goodness we finally got something to go up a level. What shall be my order of business? I can probably walk We've been past it. No, I can't. They're gonna fight me. Even though I'm like 13 levels above. I guess these guys will do anything when they've got a roughness around them. I think they're safe or something. healing we need because I don't feel very healed right now. Wonder what's inside. Wonder away. <laughs> well, visitors. Hey over now. here. Thanks. I need to fight us. Why? No, I think you really want to. Keep piling on the damage oh. over here. You're a lightsaber. Final step. How kind of your crew to come to your rescue even though they were nowhere near you. But that is their most great mistake. Because I am here to kick your butt. I hope I'm here to kick your butt. Oh, 
Yeah. See if we can keep this up. Yeah, we got a shoulder gun. Keep your heads or lose them. This how not on Bushwhacker Ferret. And we got the tier three. Might as well, right? You already know what it is. We got the break on him. Let's get that topple going. Oi! Oh, Senna's not here. They're on it. Is that really all it took? What the heck? Ah. Death of a thousand cuts should bring it up. Well, no, I guess it won't necessarily be what brings it up. Too much? Nope, we're good. Get that daisy's pop. I was about to freak out. <laughs> I was like, nah. -uh. We're in a chain attack. Come on. Come on. But it was fine. Slap that fool. Break through.
Reactive yet. There's blood. That's a pretty decent unique monster to take down today. All of the hits and all of the healing. Yeah. I'm sure that's what attacking with two swords sounds like. Champions. <clears throat> you still got a little more to go after that, though. What tip did I get? It's probably just about the yeah, Monaco's class. Hey, okay. Make life a bit easier for us.
can continue on with that one. The castle beckons. after I just took out your big meanie. I feel like you shouldn't want that. Fight that one as well. Does look pretty beatable right about now. Bet Uni would appreciate it as well. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I think I like the sound of this. I'll take point. This will be a challenge. Don't lose focus. We can do it, no doubt about it. Yeah, hurry on! health enemies in this game have. Feels like whatever you fight is like dang tough. Yeah. 
quite all right over here. Oh, I'm enjoying it. Might as well see what it looks like when we get it during the launch, right? Cat girl. Some things never cease to amaze me. I keep forgetting to do the cancel one with her. I keep thinking she's just using her hammer like you would think. But she's not. Ah! It was them. side attack button with. So like my chain attack ends up being like just death incarnate for this enemy. So I know this game. I know chain attacks get insane. I'm just waiting for it. I guess you can put out three damage. Like you know, five thousand damage as a healer, sure. Yeah. <laughs> 
They're overheating. Guess you really gotta do some active healing here, huh? Like it's gonna die before we get our train attack. Ooh. So close. Something so valuable here. Okay. That was a lot of fight. Time to mess with the soul tree. This is overdue. Shucks. It's gonna be this and then you I'm found gonna power. Oh, I just can afford it. You found power. That'll be the last thing in there is unison strike. That's one go through there to get to the opportunity in crisis. There's a lot of strong ones here. I'm definitely going to be happy to enhance his Mega Spinning Edge talent art, because that is a strong art for sure. That all I along. Trick up my sleeve. At least I'll be very soon ready for the arts canceling one to just make that all around better. This guy. Pretty basic stuff here. can clearly give you one of his um you might want to use this things I guess. Yeah yeah cheers big ears big ears cheese wow I can buy the talent art or I can buy Bought that. Can I buy them both? A new power, eh? It was so close. I'll be able to buy the heat and her talent art soon. I mean I did get the talent art. Really like her since it does damage to Mobius. Not many people have anything extra going against the Mobius. Uh, 
back to the playbook? Grants a large increase to damage dealt the more enemies targeting you. What to get, what to get, in what order? Oh my goodness. Check out this sick new skill! Yeah. Check out this sick new skill! He's a wild mouth, we see it. Got that. Guess we'll do this. Check out this sick new skill! Taking a big blade skill. Charge boost power of buff effects issued by self by 50%. You can boost up power charge. You don't have any others, I don't think. That's a debuff on the enemy. So I guess that just means that the power charge will even be stronger on him. Does that apply to everyone? I think that does apply to everyone. Now that I look at it, what did upgrading... Did I upgrade it? I thought I upgraded it. I upgraded someone, so it was a unis. Yeah, look at that modifier. Yeah, dang. Love it. Oh yeah, I can literally just read and see that. Says already upgraded if I did upgrade it. Jaguar slash. So she can do. Break on enemies. She can do. Days. Then he can do. The smash. They don't have topple in there. Pretty sure the others do. Actually, you don't have any combos. He's got a lurking spider that bursts. And topple. So you putting in work next to good old uh, 
<laughs> Miho and Noah. Why do I struggle with their names? They're not even hard names at all. Yuri's got like the weirdest name out of the bunch. And that's not even that hard to remember either, obviously. I wonder if I should put that on instead. I feel like that's the kind of thing I want on. Grand Priest. Body Double. Okay. I'm sure I've looked enough here. Boys grow stronger. <laughs> oh wow! I never got around to getting that, but that's fine. check out that lower level again. I think it was like a level 70 area, so pretty sure I'm not actually going to go in there, but if it wasn't, could be interesting. Loading screen. Pretty sure I need to beat y'all up for some stuff. Wow, Yudi still didn't finish off after that. It won't take much longer now, though. I don't want to do this, but you're in our way. Do not boss up. I believe it's taking us this long to beat up a goat. I'm the girl with the gall. This way. Whoa. Is that the upper area or something? Or lower? Cause I definitely remember this part. It was necessary to go up this vine. Or the story progression. Hmm. Huh. Huh. Giant's limb. with caution. Dangerous annihilation event. I'm still trying to determine whether that is even like a mechanic this is or not. Decent, right? Because anything I'll claim the ether here. Nothing crazy has happened yet. Your footing. 
footy. So much to see, We've got huh? all the footy here. Is this the turn thing we're this gonna be, be doing that quest for? Gotta be a toughie, huh? A formidable opponent. Eyes over here. Thanks. I tried so hard. I really tried. I almost had to smash that I wanted so badly. Actually, I'm not here. This game is horrifying. We're supposed to be over leveled. Like 15 levels, and we're still dying. I just playing the game that bad? Am I not adapting to the game mechanics this game has to offer? And, like trying to play it old school or something? Takes care of Tanya and Uni. Keep it up, Neo. Ah, very good, very good. So, let's get them switched up. Now, this did become a tough one. She's got a couple more to go, including her own that she just took to.
But of course she's back with the medic gunner. Which is kind of huge. Oh, I just... I don't know, I don't know. We've got one Nothing tank, so I kind of wouldn't like to see her on the Lost Vanguard still. Gives me a chance to look at this stuff. It's got shockwave knockback. It's got boost aggro generated when using the art. It's got a proper shield. And you recover 3% HP while you guard. A field, huh? Armor veil shield, too. Now that's interesting. Deals continuous damage to enemies in a fixed radius and draws more aggro. That's exactly what we needed in that fight earlier, actually. Radial aggro draw. That's insane. Wow. Shield wall. Mighty beats a smash. We'll definitely keep that on. Mighty beat. Set that there like that. Boost damage dealt to machines with that talent art. That's cool. Mm, a smash art though. That's exciting. I love getting the whole combo in. if it's used. Man, this is tricky. All of those are really good. Shockwave, definitely not going to be for me starting off. Do I want Electro Field? It's eight. On the recharge gauge. Veil field range of effect is small. Ooh, yeah, that's fun. Heck yeah. That's gotta be cool. Swimmer's thing. Is that right? Ether defense, physical defense. I feel like I could just be boring it up the block rate on this. Ooh. Smash damage. I'm right quite there. fond of this. I'm quite fond of this. I'm oh quite fond goodness. of this. We got good stuff. Oh, 
hoch. That start of chain attack increases TP by 5. 10% chance to absorb attack dealt to allies within range. Ho! Huh. When taking damage, chance to inflict knockback on assailant. Wow! Is there anything better here than one that didn't put the evade art on the master? Actually, I couldn't even if I wanted to. Just thinking. Unsure of who to pick right now, honestly. Um, let's see, rank. So that gives us a lot of healers, then, doesn't it? Let's just do the young smith. Yeah. I'll take the offensive then. Not gonna think too hard about it. Wonder what's inside. I don't care like this. It was. I kind of was hoping it wasn't. Rip. So back down to the lower level. I'm pretty sure I still don't belong there. I'm very sure it was 9 or 70, not 90, thankfully. Level 90 area? I don't even think there has been a like straight level 90 area where everything's level 90. Like level 90's been like boss range in most of the Xenoblades. This guy out, just in case this I need at me funny. to hey, get some of these hey, parts. Nice move, Oh, 
What are you guys thinking about this crazy adventure this game gives us? It's really something Knife else, I think. Quickly. Something so valuable here. Seventy-one. So this definitely isn't the place for us. Huh. Might be worth to try to steal some experience from the area, though. Maybe we can get the fast one on some scary enemies too. One quality, maybe. I don't know. Probably not. I'd have to be using my very best setups. For that. Huh. Good thing we found this. Heck yeah. Whoa ho ho ho. You see that huh? question mark appear when we got down here? Because I sure did. That smart. <sighs> That's what I like to see right there. Being areas that I being in areas that I don't belong in is part of the joy of Xenoblade. Ugh. Uni was not taken to that poison well at all. It had something against her every bit of existence. It sucks because there's no real way to run away in this area. If you touch the poison, it's gonna hurt you, and if the enemy finishes you off, I'll claim the I mean, ether here. I don't know. Here we go again. Ooh. That was a painful sneeze. You know those are all super strong. Oh, yeah, makes sense. This is something decent, right? There is dragons here. Riku not like look of that enemy. That is a whole dragon. And that's a giant bug up there. This is horrifying.
Why is this place like this? It's looking right at me. I'm gonna die here. Don't look at me, monkey. Topographical info update. Wonder what's inside. <sighs> this looks handy dandy. is everywhere. What? What is it with her and her plumage? We're in a deadly situation. And you're worried about your plumage? We do not like look of that Oof, enemy. That thing. No, 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 no. Anything. Hey, a ladder. So easy. Wonder what's inside. Do you live all alone out here in the forest? <sighs> ging ging will go wherever wind blow, like strong dandelion fluffs. Oh. Time for ging ging to choose best tree shade tud napping by chasing brown butterfly. Okay. Good to add more names. Eh? Wait, what? I don't really want to track a knock on right now. I'm kind of horrified. Smarts. Let's use this. Tracks are clearly here. Silence. No croak, no chat, no want of touch. And time of Gingen to melt clean away. What does it mean? Perhaps she's giving us some sort of warning. Gingen walk so Gingen can hear voice of ground. This is normal. Not really sure why I came here. <laughs> it's so scary. Sunrise and better run away. Gingin -gin chase dreams all the way to here. Ugh. Maybe this is her favorite place? Rain and dew make ants of blue. Ultramarine for precise hue. 
and can show the way. Oh boy. This is one strange and not upon you. Why did I even tell myself to come here? Is it safer while we're following Gengen though? Is that what's happening? I'm happy about that at least. Gengen not go any further. Only thoughts run ahead. Gengen want to avoid a love raspberry stain spreading. Are you saying there's something dangerous up ahead? I'm showing it time to give chairs of travelers back to Tartan... Tartan Ladybird. You can never go wrong with some ether. Back on it. Why are these ether channels loaded lately? Whoa! Got a rare dude all right here. Gingen feel tickle in chess when hear words. Tomorrow Gingen have conversation with birds. Aren't you lonesome on your own, Gingen? Do you want us to take you to a colony or a caravan or something? Gingen fine. Gingen waiting for days when seven anvils ring. Only at then will Gingen leave garden. I see. There's something you have to do. Oh. Huh. Oh. Well, I guess we'll come back and see you someday. Very random quest. We're going up in the world. So valuable here. I don't like our chances. Somehow I'm huh. <laughs> staying alive in this horrifying what's area. Inside.
he's actually moving. Gotta take this chance. Whoa! Check this place out! Wonder what's inside. This looks handy dandy. Elevate here or what? Hmm. Now, we wait. Very interesting. Whoa. It let us out in the nice and Time comfy for a nice colony. Big breakfast. Oh. you operate it like so okay have it just lets me out at that normal area right maybe that's um <gasps> Something we haven't been able to get to before. Have I always been able to come up here? Wonder what's so I'm inside. Surprised I never saw the staircase. But at the same time, I have been on um, pretty. bad at finding stuff. Looks like I could have climbed all the way up here. Can't just leave them there. Maybe I should go with Grisania. It's horrible that a horse here had to die in such a place. Oh. Got it all memorized. Hmm. No word from him again. She left her colony for, I believe. I hope she's doing okay there. This sounds pretty serious. Lots of stuff. If you want to survive in this here Mothka Wildwood, you'll need to learn about mushrooms. Mushrooms? Why mushrooms? <laughs> well, they may look fun and all, but you better not be underestimating them. Some mushrooms are priceless, priceless treasures, others are toxic like you wouldn't believe. Naughty night. The naughty night. Takes the crown there. You eat one of them by mistake, then the next thing you know, you might wake up inside some monster's stomach. Sounds like a scoop. You're looking to go to Kev's castle. Then you'll need to go back from the top of Tal to the place where we fought. There's a rope side there you can use to get on your way. Careful you don't defend too far though. The monsters down there are formidable. Huh. Good thing we found this. Carizia makes absolutely dreamy accessories, you know? She's so good with her hands, it's enough to make you jealous. Mm. <coughs> <coughs> A 
We've got so much stuff to do here at Colony Tau. Really do need to just team up with the commander and get some of it done. Karezia came back to us recently. She was in Colony Gamma getting inspired, but it looks like there's something on her mind. Got it all memorized. Alright, Unipa. It's goo Leave time. It to me. Ghost for Unipa. So many conversations are going to be had here. Let's make the most of our break, guys. Where should I start? The people of Tao certainly know their mushrooms. I'm kind of envious. I still can't quite teleport which ones are edible and which ones aren't. Banana must also brush up on mushroom malogy. Riku, <laughs> Riku agree in totality. It's not such a long time ago that everybody sleep righteous sleep and get food stolen by Tarkins. But Manana already apologized for that. And anyway, it was simple blunder. Yeah, and besides that, it wasn't just your fault. Manana will not make the same mistake twice. From now, we'll spare no effort in pursuit of deep fungal knowledge. When discover mushrooms, we'll eat every one. Then we'll definitely learn through experience. <laughs> yeah. I'm afraid sleeping too soundly will be the least of your problems then. No worries. Stomach of banana made from 100% indestructible stainless steel. I don't know how reassured I feel. Banana never tire in pursuit of knowledge. We should probably make a point of keeping some tummy soothing herbs on hand. Yeah, I think we'll have to. You will come round for a second. Riku, I've been thinking, but not on caravans. They move around on them, this is correct? Correct. What of? I just realized regular Levenesses cannot normally operate too far from their home, their home colony, due to ether cylinder limitations. So, how is it that the caravans get around everywhere? Reason is simple. Caravan Levness is small and lightweight. Also not loaded up with weaponry and fundamentally not expected to fight. That's why ether consumption much lower. I see. Yes, that makes sense. That explains how they're able to operate over long distances. In other words, very, very green energy. Huh? How can energy be inexperienced? It just means power consumption is low. Understood. Thank you for explaining, Riku. It's been a good learning experience. Let's lay out the facts. Everyone's commenting on how Kalini Tao's gained a few knock on. Napan are every place. It's true. Napan very hardy people. The locals are a bit afraid of them, it seems. I can't say I'd call any Napan I've ever met scary. If Honorine invited them, I'm sure they can't be bad. Stuff in the faces, eh? And here I thought Manana was the only one capable of that. Hate of rudeness. Alright, enough prattling, all of you. Shall we look into it then? Good idea. 
Let's talk to all the Nafan as well. I think we need to discuss this. So is harvest time a big deal for you lot? Yes, yes. We grow virtually all our own food in the colony. We can't sustain ourselves on hunting alone, you know. What's the harvest festival all about then? Nothing special. Just a harvest, really. We have a lot of crops to bring in at this time of year. The only problem is we're a bit short-handed this year. People are braced for hard work. Can we be of any use? It's just harvesting, right? I can do harvesting. Would you? It would delay your journey. <laughs> this is the part where you just thank us and just thank us graciously and move on. Uni's right. Okay then. Thank you. I'll be grateful for your help. Alright, let's get on this thing. Everyone will be waiting by the entrance to Colony Tau. Let's lay out the facts. Is Rain okay? Seems like his injury is still not stopping him diving headfirst into trouble. He was a sworn friend of my predecessor and a masterful hunter. I understand your concern, but I believe he can take care of himself. So he's a hunter too, eh? He was my hunting teacher for a while. That said, I will say that he doesn't know when to stop chasing a monster. That's not a good combination with injury. I know he's a capable guy, but it was overextending himself that got him hurt in the first place. In that case, maybe we should go look for him. If it looks like he's being reckless, we'll bring him back. Sound good? Sounds great. Let's do it. Uh, hang on, I'm getting a call from Gim. Hey, Juniper's with you, right? Listen, sorry for the short notice, Juniper, but could you come and meet me sh uh, sharpish? We think we found rain. I think we'd better do as he says. Let's go see Gim and quick. Where should I start? Hey everyone, I got something I've been meaning to ask you all. Is it about Levnesses? If so, you should probably address it to Riku, not us. Lens, you are correct, and Tyon, ordinarily, you would also be correct. But, I want to know what everyone's favorite Levnesses are. You mean, like, do I prefer... Equities? Or, uh... Abilities? Exactly. For me, I guess a thorax. Makes it easier to get around. I like Belenias myself. They look... They just look fun. What about you, Tyon? Uranus, I suppose. It's on the cutting edge of technology. No, Mio. Favorite loudness is... Hmm. I don't think I've ever looked at Levnesses through that particular lens. Me neither. What's your fave then, Baldi? Me? Well, obviously it'd have to be. Uh, we already know yours. No need to say it. Why? I want to say it. Let me say it. Better be Mecha Friend. Let's lay out the facts. Gray, you come from the city, don't you? Yeah. 
No need to be so standoffish, mate. You're allowed to talk, you know. Don't usually bother with trivial stuff. So, you have a wife, don't you? Do you want to go see her? Fine, either way. Come on, that's no good. She'll want to see you. You can always drop in while you're giving your report to the, for the lost numbers. Oh yeah, you kept all that about the lost numbers quiet, didn't you? I told you, I don't talk about unimportant stuff. I cannot believe this bloke. Let's have it out then. Proposal. Let's go and see this wife of yours. Taking your silence as a yes. Good work, team. Let's go. Lovebirds. Let's lay out the facts. Colony Tau doesn't have any offseers, does it? No. We return our dead to the earth. Weird thing to do. I never heard of anyone doing that. Who grows up in the forest goes back to the forest, and until that time comes, a peaceful resting place awaits you. I am from Agnes, and even I have never heard of this custom. I suppose it's deeply rooted in Colony Tales culture. It is. Which is why concept of sending off isn't something we've ever had to consider. But. You did have an officer in the past, from what I've heard. In the past, yes. But he was killed in combat with caves. Were you there, Juniper? I was. He drew enemy fire with the rear guard. I wouldn't have escaped were it not for his sacrifice. Well, that's depressing. But what did your officer usually do, given that he wouldn't be off scene? Tilled the fields, mostly. As I said, we didn't really need officers. Still depressing. Actually, could I ask you to send off our officer? Of course, if that's what you want. If there is a place we return to, then surely there are avenues other than the Earth to reach it. That's what I've come to believe, anyway. You know? If there is, if there really is some peaceful place waiting somewhere, <sighs> that's a lovely thought. Do you know where the officer is? We'll get there straight away. Thanks. I'll take you. I think we need to discuss this. I wonder how the people who have left the colony are doing. They've stayed in regular contact, and as far as I can tell, they seem to be doing well enough. Though Imogen's transmission was cut off, I don't know what happened. That's a bit alarming. Imogen's not the type to do anything irregular, so it's unsettling that she wouldn't get in contact with us. Well, where did she go again? Colony 4. Do you know why she went there? I don't, actually. All I know is that she was very dead set on it. Hmm. In that case, would it be worth going to look for her? Colony 4 are an upstanding bunch, so I don't expect that anything bad will have happened. Still. Let's go anyway. Find out from Imogen herself. Oh my goodness, her face. Let's lay out the facts. Corezia left for Colony Gamma, didn't she? Right, even before the flame. Right, even before the flame clock was broken, she'd always been interested in life outside the colony. As soon as she got the chance, she picked up and set off for Gamma. Must be so cool to be able to make accessories. Yeah, she's always been quite dexterous. 
Oh, he's big into playing her advantages. Alright, you got me interested. What sort of stuff does she make? Oh, let's go visit her and you can find out yourself. That's a nice idea. Okay, let's see how Karasi is doing. We're doing it. Let's bounce. Good to add more names. That was a whole lot of quest doing. Looks like colony relations have changed. Hey, Caressia, do you have a moment to talk? Sure, what's up? We hear you're quite the accessory maker. I was hoping we could take a gander at your work. Oh, I see. I do enjoy making things. Not sure I'd say any of it was good, though. Don't be modest. Everyone in Gamma adores your work, don't they? Oh, uh, well, uh, I guess. But I can't just come out and say that myself. If your work is as lovely as it sounds, I think you're allowed to be proud of it. Yeah, I suppose. You know, you've actually come at the perfect time. We were just talking about something. Oh yeah? Karezia has been telling me she wants to study more accessories. Hey! She's just too shy to say it. So what do you say? Would you be able to bring some more accessories here for her to study? Hmm, I see. I mean, just there's lots of styles and things I've never seen before. It's just a little hobby of mine, though. I wouldn't want to annoy the colony with it. On the contrary, the application of such a skill might actually contribute a positive effect on colony development. What did you have in mind? If you can make accessories, you can sell them to other colonies. I think there'd be a decent market for it. Hmm. Either you were right. That sounds like a really good idea. How does that sound, Caressia? You can use your hobby to help the colony out. I'll do my best. In that case, I think I really need to see other styles of accessories. It'll help me improve my craft. We can certainly help you out with that. Thank you. Then bring me as many different things as you can, please. Will do. Just sit tight. And we'll be back before you can say bring on trend. Or bang on trend. Looks like colony relations have changed. Let's see what we can hand now, over. What was it we needed? Dang, really? Nothing? I don't have a single one of these. That sucks. Honorine, do you have a second? Ah, I've had it with you. Huh? How many times do I have to tell you? I do not have time for this. Would you... Would like to eat meat, please? Would like to eat sweets, please? Forest is too scary and full of bugs. Please fix. What the? Who or what am I even looking at here? The ultimate Napan fusion is rare to meet. Ouch. Sorry about that. My ear, of all things, was giving me a sharp pain <clears throat> but anyway Juniper I'm begging you please do something about these fuzzballs 
Like, uh, like what? How you say such thing when we come all this way for you? You didn't come for me. You came for yourselves. I went to Colony 30 to learn a bit about machines. And all I got was these lousy napan. Whoa, just chill for a second. Getting all that up ain't gonna solve anything. Eating sweets is good for helping the issue of anger and management. I'm done. I'm just so done. Give me a minute and I'll boot them out. Or we could just resolve it with no booting necessary. Oh, come on, Juniper. I can't believe you're siding with them over me. Well, while we're here, why not listen to what they have to say? You good and understanding person. All we really won't do. All we want to do really is help. Oh. What are you going to help with? We very whiz with machine. And we make very interesting thing for you. The only thing you've made uh, for us is a giant dent on our food supply as you walking stomachs. Meh meh. What stain on honor? I am officially all napand out. Got to check on the meat I'm drying. You preserve food. Yeah, I have to do it in a hut, which is already enough of a chore. So I really do not have time for these jokers today. Oh, is that inconvenience? Oh, it finally clicked, did it? Yes, you are an inconvenience to me, you fuzzy nuisances. Irene, please calm down. I've never seen you like this. Look, a drying and smoking meat takes a lot of work. Colony Town is a special place. I know that to you it may seem that our ways are inefficient, but... Yes, that's exactly why we here. We can help with Build Meat Smoker. What? But currently, parts of Smoker is missing. Cure for this is procure for us. If you could do something like that, why didn't you just say so? Are we going to want to eat meat soon? So Smoker should be built. Snip, snap. No, can't talk to him. Napon always very devoted to filling, fulfilling own wishes. Okay. <laughs> okay, so if, say, we were to get the parts you need for the smoker, you'd be able to build it. Napon always keep word. Can rely on us. Okay, good. Honorine, uh, we'll need your help too. Fine. Just for you, Juniper. You know they aren't being malicious. Let's see if we can get these parts for them. Good luck. Now, what was it we needed? To add more names. <gasps> Looks like colony relations have changed. As a colony, we're mostly self sufficient. So we need arable land, enabling you to grow your own food without having to forage. Good thinking. Juniper. Oh, you are friends. We've come to help with the harvest. Do you need a hand with anything? Uh, 
Are you serious? Yeah, sure. There's plenty of work going around. Glory, don't just... I'd accept a Turkens out right now, so they're in. Carson and Glory are in charge of assigning the work in the fields. It's better for me to be nearby given the injuries coming in. Injuries? I'd have thought farming could be so dangerous. Don't be dense, there's always danger in the forest. So how about it? Still willing? Of course, just tell us what you need from us. In that case, how do you feel about digging up potatoes? Spud Patrol, got it. Thanks, shouldn't take long if you all pitch in. Let's dig up some spongy spuds. That looks like all of them. This is hard work. I'll do my best. There's been a change in colony relations. There's quite a few, huh? More for the harvest. Change looks like. Huh? Would you believe it? You leave all those taters to me. That should be enough, right? Let's report back to Carson. I'll do my best. I'll take point. This is something decent, right? Ooh. <laughs> okay. Random. Hey, we're done with the harvest. Uh, what's going on? Shh. Quiet. They'll see you. You want to elaborate for us, love? The monsters that have their greedy eyes on our spuds. They're coming this way. This happens every single time. The amount of collateral damage they've caused, I swear. I did wonder what harvesting methods you were using to cause so many casualties. This makes more sense. We'd usually muster the whole colony to drive them off, but this year we're short of people, so... Ugh, what do we do? Remember what Uni said, just think us graciously. No need to stand on ceremony. Ugh, oh, right. Yes, sure. And you'll be there too, Juniper, of course. Now let's clear out those monsters. Sounds like a plan. Come here, food. I don't want to do this, but you're in our way. I don't no, want to do this. They look delicious. Yeah. 
Champion. Huh. page for a sec. What do you want spoilers for? What do you, 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 you... What you got going on over there? Welcome to the stream, Wolf. We took care of the monsters in the vicinity. Glad to hear it. We wouldn't have been able to manage it so elegantly on our own. We can't just let them off with the... Uh, with your treasured data, now can we? You've got that right. We put our blood, sweat, and tears into growing these little spuds. Gloria and the others aren't technically in charge of the fields, but they help out. When I see them all working so hard, the thought of those monsters stealing our hard-earned crops makes me fume. I bet. No one likes being robbed. There's no need to stress over it. If you overthink everything like Cursor near, any loss will be a big shot. Hey, come on now. Anyway, the monsters are out of the picture as far... So, as far as I'm concerned, that's a win. You're right. Roland will be pleased to stock up on more monster meat, too. He's such a greedy guts. I'd rather he sharpen his sense of danger a bit more. If he wants to eat, he has to work. Hard. But isn't that the exact opposite of... Yes. Uh, never mind. Anyway, thank you very much for your help. Way to change the subject. Leave it. We harvested the potatoes and there's no harm done. That's the important thing here. True that. All that's left is to eat the fruits or veg of our labors. Will they let you know when the grub's up? Ah, something you happened to encounter yesterday, eh? I see some relations have changed. Something so valuable here. You've got me curious now, buddy. Whatever might you have encountered, friend? My stomach's growling. said you'd found Ray. Look, the beacon stone. Oh, wait, but that's... Juniper, what's that smoke? It's a beacon stone. We use them when we can't get normal communication out. They release smoke to warn of danger. Wait, uh, do you think... Looks like your man's in trouble. Uh, rain. We said you'd go hunting to replenish our last luckers. 
lackluster food supplies. Okay, I'll follow the beacons then. Again, you wait here. You'll ignore the spoilery ones, even though you probably want to see the spoilery one. <laughs> you still haven't fully recovered yourself, have you? I'm not risking you too. Understood. Just in case. Tell Glory to come after us. We'll be there too. Don't worry. Okay. Thanks. Let's make a move. We only use beacon stones for emergencies. I hope nothing bad's happened. I'm sure it'll be fine. Let's go check. Guess this is still quick. What? No. I missed it that bad. Not Are you this. kidding me? Is this like a rare thing? This pleases me for not showing the hero Let's face. Use this. Excuse me. <laughs> You're a mysterious fellow sometimes, you know that? I feel like you're plotting something here. I get this feeling you found out about a certain ultimate power or something. And you're picking my brain or something. You need to know so you can get back to your Whoa, game. <laughs> oh my lord. Are you even home? What have you been doing today? You had a lot of photo shoots. This is the first I've heard from you today. Heroes, huh? What about it? Who are you looking for? Ew, Baltimore. I don't like that place. bothering you. Peerless, Riku, and Manana. I love how there are two characters in one. It's still funny to me. Okay. We're 
sliding down. We fought Kavesi here. Many of my friends fell. Is this where the fight was? Yes, the battle was around here. We were outnumbered. We managed to hold our own at first, leveraging our advantages, but you can't argue with numbers in the end. The rear guard's actions saved so many of us. Even so, there's no way out once you've been cornered in a place like this. Looks like the monsters here have made... Monsters have made themselves at home here now. Can't do any fending off like this. Let's get rid of them before they become a problem then. Hmm. Uh, oh, yes, of course. That sounds good. Come on. Where's your energy? Let's whoop their asses. Let me hear you say it. Uh... Let's, uh, smack their behinds. Eh, close enough. Let's go. Okay, well, we doing this? Oh, eyes over here! You think that's enough to distract me? Some hovering reefs that only make me feel sadness because I remember them so vividly? Hmm? There were so many monsters here. I wouldn't have been able to clear them all out without your help. Thank you. Okay, let's begin. Please, give them a peaceful sleep. Yeah, for sure. We can't leave it like this. Your body crashed, but you're awake now, aren't it? Aha! Uh -huh. So that light was you. We thought it might have been ascending off. It looks so. It looks so soft and gentle. Yeah. They can all rest easily now. The old commander died here too. And was left where he fell. Oh, really? He was the first to fall. He's the one who promoted Juniper, 
and ensured our new commander's escape. He was so strong and kind, I idolized him. He was always thinking of the colony. He helped Jennifer get back to safety and fought to the bitter end. So he promoted you to commander. Unusual, but given circumstances, I can see why. Yes, you carry on his legacy. I think that's a wonderful thing. Our officer at the time understood how we operated. He worked hard to make himself useful. He was very gentle, that officer, much like Rosania. Graziana, in that respect. Did you just call me gentle? And Cardamine may be rough around the edges, but he takes his duty seriously. Just like the old commander. We all inherited something of the commander. The whole of Colony Tau. We can see him in your strength and kindness too, Jennifer. That's why he named you his successor. He fought so hard to protect the colony you'd inherit. Yes, I suppose you're right. After meeting Noah and the others, I see there's still so much we could change. We have to look for new trails to blaze, instead of stagnizing as we are. We'll help as much as we can, too. Whatever choice you take, Commander, we'll follow. We believe in you. That's good to hear. Thank you. We'll all have our band. We'll all have to band together to build a new town, and we'll make our late friends proud. Uh, how I handled all the floating islands, huh? It hurt. We're going up in the world. I I don't know how I was handling it. I mainly felt huh. sorrow. Huh. They're also dead. I see some relations have changed. Watch your footing, guys. Settle down, Lands. You're not that heavy. Sounds like a gogol moving around. what huh. the vines we just climbed up hmm is that what you're going to check <laughs> so you want me to distract myself on the floating what? islands huh what's that Check out what it bombed! Oh, night has fallen. Come on, baby, cough it up. <laughs> yeah, free food. Is that sushi? Hey, it's fish. Free fish. Take this rope. Is there a good use for that? Yeah, 
Are you it? Hey, you it. We're sliding down. Hmm. We found rain. Rain, are you all right? You guys, how did you? We saw your beacon stone, but you're hurt. Pretty bad, but it'll be fine. I've got this. I'm losing my edge. Overestimated myself. Thought I could outdo you, Juniper. Stop talking. These wounds won't close up unless you hold still. Sorry. Looks like the hunter got himself hunted. That query, that monster, it was a strange one felt off and dangerous. I understand, Rain. You will rest now. That's an order. I can hardly argue back in this sorry state. I'll be good. Let's go monster hunting. Okay. Guess I gotta track it. Give me that. Big boy prints. saying is that you encountered something way before I had there huh. and you think it will be valuable for me to explore at my leisure ah so this is just you giving a friendly a you know a bit of advice friendly tidbit and not you trying to distract me ah I gotcha I gotcha back in that area. It's actually kind of what I'm prepping for. I wasn't necessarily planning on going crazy on the aisles, but I've got some business to attend to there. I'm gonna need Valdi's help for it. But hey, maybe I won't need Valdi's help for it. We'll see. Good thing we found this. This is not the direction I want to be going in. But the tracks lead me this way. No great choice in the matter. us. How's it going so far? Oh, we're just gathering up these side quests and knocking them out. We got plenty to do. There aren't any, huh? Maybe it went down here. Probably. Should we follow? No. If it's got a way to the lower levels, we don't need to pursue it. It won't be back here anytime soon, and we'd be putting ourselves in great danger down there. Okay. Let's head back then and make sure Rain's okay.
your ideals are invincible. Your distraction from us, such endeavors will be all the same as it is a benefit to you. Oh well, pray. Is that all I am to you? Hey, would you mind telling us a bit more about your former commander? Not at all. He had a strong sense of responsibility. Very gentle by nature. And an inspiring figure. I think every one of us was willing to lay down our lives for him. He sounds like he was a wonderful person. That he was. Now Juniper fills his shoes and is every bit the commander he was. When hunting our prey, we still our breath and wait for the perfect moment to strike. Seems like our way of fighting didn't work against you, though. Yeah, well, it didn't stop you from scaring the crap out of me. <laughs> I guess we still haven't lost it, then. Ah, duh, that makes sense. What happened to that monster I was hunting? It got away. Probably down in the lower levels now. Escaped the town that way. Did it? <sighs> Spox, I almost had it as well. Gotta be on guard in case it's rears it rears its mug again. What are you feeling? What this? It's not that big of a. Yes, it is that big of a deal. Don't think you can charge off like a buffoon again. Oh, glory! Jennifer went to the trouble of going out to look for you. you better behave with a modicum, modicum of dignity. Uh, if you pull anything like this again, I'll tie you to a tree. All in all, a happy resolution. That should settle things down for a while. Let's hope so. Quest complete. I see some relations have changed. Huh. Whoa. I'm getting stuck. Over to Colony 4. Must say you do have me interested in what might be lying on those islands. I'm pretty sure I was thorough when I first got there, but not to say things shouldn't change, or I might have missed something. Okay, so we're handing over... Man, why are these all so terrible? It's everything I had. Jeez. I'd prefer quality over quantity when you're picking up these rocks. Good quality samples will speed up my inspections after all. 
Now then, go out there. I'm crowding on you. Sheesh. That's odd. No sign of him again anyway. She definitely said she was coming to Colony 4. Have you tried getting in touch with her again? I've tried a few times, but she never picks up. Do you think she got caught up in something? I don't get that impression. If she had, then it would be unusual for everyone to be acting so normally in Colony 4. You're right about that. If she's going outside the colony, it's going to be a challenge to find her. I think all we can do is ask around here. Hello, sorry. We're looking for a soldier called Emma again. Do you know anything about her? This is a bit random. Emma again? Yeah, she's supposed to have come to Colony 4, but no one's been able to reach her. She's from Magnus, isn't she? I know she arrived here a short while ago. Not sure where she is now, though. Oh, well. Now you mention it, she came asking me the same thing. You mean she was looking for someone? Any idea who? I have my suspicions, actually, but... I can't say any more about it. Oh, huh? Why not? I just can't. I'm sorry, but that's all about it I can tell you. Well, alright. Thanks for your help. My stomach's growling. We're looking for a Kalania Tau soldier named Imogen. Can you tell us anything about her? Meh meh. Imogen. Friend to say? Right. No one's been able to get in touch with her. So we're a bit worried. She looked very pondering, but Kukucha not talk with her. I see. Well, thanks anyway. Sorry Kukucha not more helping. Hello, and hello to your Agnes friend. I'm actually looking for someone. Do you know an Emugen? Emugen? Yeah, she came from Colony Tower, I think. So you know her? Eh? I wouldn't say we're particularly well acquainted, but... She was a bit suspicious. Suspicious? That's not the Emugen I know. She always seemed to be looking for something. Sniffing around the procurement division and the tactician squad. That said, she looked a little too conspicuous to be a spy. Interesting. Okay. Thanks for your help. Strange. What's she on about? this now we don't get many visitors here. Does the name Emogen mean anything to you? We're trying to find her. Emogen? Yeah, I remember her. She came in and took a look at the Lemnuses. Strange look in her eyes. You know her? She was a corpse, that one. I told her not to come in here looking so grim and sent her packing. I... I see. There's an old battleground nearby, so I told her to go straighten herself out a bit. I reminded her that there's a war on. Thanks for the information. This is some story. Let's go discuss all this.
Let's make the most of our break, guys. All right, let's hear this out. Forest living. I don't remember getting that. Could you all let's come around it. for a second? Colony Tower sure is a bad, a baddie place, huh? An understatement, if I've ever heard one. It's straining the definition of the word colony. Well, I like the rich natural environment. Yeah, that's about the only thing they've got for them. Even their clock was almost all the way out. And they don't seem to use their fur on as much. But conversely, that makes it harder for enemy troops to find them. Doesn't seem to be much traffic in that area. Their console hardly even visits them. They've been left to fend for themselves in so many ways. Hard to believe they've survived that way for so long. It does beg the question, doesn't it? It's a, myster it's a mysterious twist of fate that led us to meet and get to know them truly. Right? Maybe it wasn't so bad getting shot at after all, eh, Andy? Excuse me, uh, how do you like to be on the receiving end next time? Could you all come around for a second? Okay, I'm lost. So, where did Imogen go? You know, she was definitely in Colony 4 at some point. This is only speculation, but I think Imogen's looking for someone working outside the colony. Alessandra from the medic team and Solomon of the procurement division have both been known to work further afield. But it doesn't look like she... I think I have an idea. Just a little one, but still. Mugen was still a bit hung up when the colony was freed. Hung up? On what exactly? She had a friend who was killed in a battle with another colony. A really close friend. So you think she might be searching for whoever killed her friend? But why focus on Colony 4? No idea. We weren't fighting Colony 4 back then. What if the colony you were fighting was destroyed and its soldiers reassigned? Maybe she heard something about it from one of the Napan caravans and set off to track them down. It's possible, but we can't say much more than that. So this is about revenge. Spike me. She wouldn't. Well, we're at a kind of loose end here, anyhow. Where in the Queen's royal robes could she be? We heard she'd been sent to that battlefield. We may as well search all along that way. What do you say? Hmm. Let's. I hope she hasn't gone and done anything stupid. So Shadow, when you Much were goofing better. around talking about distractions and you said you got like info, did you mean like the actual info system in the game? Like will I have to come across a thing that Let's took you up. to the reefs or is that just you talking the way you talk? Telling me to go spend time in the reefs. So close to being filled out, no. Alright, what are you up to? I'm again. Shipper, what are you doing here? That's what I want to know. 
What's going on here? Why haven't you been in contact? Sorry, I lost track of time. Is your no idea of a nice day out or something? No, not really. Not doing anything out here. What do you mean by that? I came searching for whoever... Whoever killed... It's okay, I know. But there was no one left to find. He died soon after he was reassigned here. This is all that's left to even show there was a battle here. Or are you going to avenge your friend? No. When the flame clock was broken, for some reason, I saw my friend's face. And also their killers. It's the worst feeling, isn't it? I started to wonder what the killer was doing with his life. I wanted to meet him just once. But it was too late. Everyone in Colony Fora said he'd fought bravely for his friends. So you couldn't get the closure you needed. I didn't get to meet him. But I kind of feel better about it all. He was fighting for something too. Wow. If he was our enemy. And I hated him so much, but he was still just a soldier with friends he cared for. You're right, and those feelings of friendship are something we hold on to as well. I'm sorry I made you come all this way. Shall we go back to Tao? Not yet. I think I want to stay here a bit longer. Colony 4 would have considered me an enemy at one time. But they've treated me so kindly. I want to learn from them before I go back. Got it. I think it'll be a good experience for you. But please, please, please keep in touch, okay? I will. Thanks, Juniper. And thank you, too. Oh. Doesn't take info. I see some relations have changed. Looks like colony relations have changed. Parker. Not necessarily what I meant to do there. So let's go hit the rest spot. And then I'll explore that area. First we'll let Jennifer get her rest. Let's make the most of our break, guys. Rip. Not bad. I definitely feel stronger. That helps out. Are we all ready to fight? And then I'll be taking this one. I'm coming this creature with you. is much needed. And where are you sure within the well game? Rested. Shadow Apex. Shoot. Hey, <laughs> baby. God dang, I just shot him in the face. What's wrong with me? Right then, should we get a move on? Right before getting into the castle. far along on sword fighter but everybody else is pretty fresh right here leave the enemies to me uh, I'll keep us safe from harm like so I'll heal you right actually up. some merit to doing this which is exciting 
put you on this. I'll keep you safe and snug. What about you? Might quite possibly be one of the best choices. Rip my ether cylinders, indeed. I hardly know what to spend them on because I am really gonna have to like go quite a bit backwards and like find those niche little enemies so I can do a bunch of gem crafting. I really need to hunker down and do that. The problem is it's gonna get so boring on stream, but I'm like wanting to be in the habit of like catching all the good moments on stream. So it's like a weird back and forth of is that something I should do off stream or should I stream it? Because if I stream it, that'll also make it easier for me to remember what was dropping what. So I can take note of that for later. I'll take the offensive then. Wait a I'm minute. I'm quite fond of this. Extends duration when quelling enemy rage with burst. It burst quells. Might need to survive later fight since hard mode, maybe. Uh, yeah, I'm not quite sure what you might be familiar with because you are clearly like seeing it while approaching the castle for the first time and I'm trying to figure out what it might have been so burst is kind of crazy and I finally paid attention to the fact that um Tyon's or Boris form has a burst move so it is like an actual move that finishes the chain. I've been so confused at who's been doing it, but yeah, Burst is totally a thing. Which is cool. Ooh. Yikes. So far, I've definitely noticed Tyon and Teach have it. I don't know how much better it is in comparison to Smash. If it's quelling rage, that's kind of crazy. I don't, I don't know. If Smash does that thing. I mean, rage is new to this game, so that's like another like layer. for this. So the hovering reefs, eh? Uh, uh. Oh. Very interesting. Here I was gonna do something real crazy.
Very true. I'm going to be wanting all the items. Oh, hey! Here's a goodie. Wonder what's inside. Are knock on coins okay? They're climbing right back up again, that's for sure. So clearly I miss a canister right off the bat. I'm not sure how so I, I did. I kind of want to go them. back to my stream and see it how. It appears the fighting wasn't all that long ago. There might still be enemies nearby. Huh? The absurdity of battle never ceases to amuse me. What's her deal? She a Kavesi soldier? Uh, she's coming this way. Lives are so easily lost, and in service to all manner of nonsense. Truly, this is why. We'll never be able to stop fighting. Wouldn't you agree? Um, can we...? So then, did you, uh, did you help us out just now? Uh oh we're not out of the woods just yet. Seems we have some new guests coming. Huh? We're surrounded. Only one thing for it. Yeah. Get ready. <laughs> oh, aren't you all just adorable? This ain't the time for jokes. <laughs> I guess you're right. It's way too early to start laughing. Because the fun is only just getting started. The Wrath of Asura. Just now. Those were Kavesi soldiers. Ah, well spotted. Their forces from Colony 11 up ahead. And going by your appearance, I'd say you're also a Kavesi soldier. Hmm? Who? Me? Tell us who you are. What colony are you from? Hmm. Well then, if you absolutely must know, I'm the commander of Colony 11, whose soldiers just attacked us. Wow, cool. <laughs> wow, cool. Wait, what? Huh? 
their commander. Hang on. Back it up. If you're the commander of Colony 11, then you're... a Shearer. The Undying Blade. Undying? What in the Queen's name? She meant to be some kind of celebrity. There ain't a defender worth their salt in all of Kevers who hasn't heard of her. She's the commander of a silver rank colony, in the running for the strongest person in Kevers. Getting back on topic, you're telling us you were attacked by your own colony. Hmm. I suppose I am telling you that. But why? What for? Well, I guess I have given them a couple of reasons. These things happen, you know. Anyway, I'm going to remove Colony 11 from the equation. You guys want to come with? <laughs> huh? Come with? Why? Uh, sorry? Now it's open season. This is all kinds of stupid. But you're talking about your own colony. Your mates. You'll just go off and fight them. Sure. One rarely gets to enjoy a battle such as this. Also, I have my own reasons for killing them. <laughs> okay. Besides, sitting back and letting them keep taking swings at me is not my style. It's just... no fun that way. I don't think you meant to say that part out loud. Well, but... why are you inviting us to join you? Huh? So you're telling me you're not the great and terrible Ouroboros? Huh? Y you knew? Come now. I've heard this personally from the Queen. Every commander alive knows about you lot. As I hear it, you're some kind of rebels going around wrecking colonies' flame clocks. That's outrageous. Well, it's also true, mostly. But we don't do it just for the fun of it. It sounds like you're not everyone's favorite person right now either. What's your goal? <laughs> Surely it's self-evident, no? On the battlefield, you have one of two options. Fight and live, or fight and die. Oh. When considering the pure act of trading life back and forth, there's no separation into enemies and allies. Not for the killers, nor for the ones being killed. That's something you soldiers should get. More so now you've rebelled and made sure everyone wants your heads. Like I keep saying, nobody here did that on purpose. I'm sure. Everyone has their own way of thinking. I'm not trying to say otherwise. In any case, there's a place for you on my battlefield, if you feel like joining. I'm sure Colony Eleven will give you a warm welcome. <laughs> Though maybe not the one you'd wish for. Huh. What is her problem? What in the Queen's snow white wings does she want from us? I don't know. But she certainly seems to be after something. Good to add more names. So. No idea how I passed it in the first place. More so colonies out here for yourself, eh? Odd. Huh. Where is that? What am I doing wrong? This is why I can't read. Here. Noah, would you mind? So let me show you what one of my misconceptions about this was. So I had guessed she was like the captain, right? Because you know, all of the people who we've been getting as heroes are captains and such. So I remember this entrance. And from this angle, of course, that's the colony. So it looks exactly like the waypoints leading us towards here. 
you know, for her quest. So I came down this bridge, and there's a body, there's a body, there's a body, and there's this robot. And I'm like, oh no, I've got to fight this to start the quest, don't I? So I've been all day getting ready to fight this guy, because I thought I'd have to fight him to go through the gate and start the quest. I thought he was the trigger. So I'm gonna try to kick his butt. I did just realize I don't have body when I was meant to have body. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, So yeah, like I was paying attention and I'm like, this is weird. Like she should totally I'm coming with you. have been here by now. Cause I'm all like, yeah, there's totally like an order that you obtain the glasses in. And I'm like going through and going through, but this one was missing. So I'm like, so obviously this is where the quest starts, but for some reason I have to fight a absolutely horrendous thing to get into the colony to start the quest but I was just wrong and somehow I missed the colony or this quest start in the first place not sure how I missed it but I missed it Keep oh yeah heads or lose them. think Attack! I've been preparing for this death all day Guy. 
I think body reviving. Or maybe he gets good. Long enough. Oh Lord. Oh, what do I start with in this horrible situation? See how it goes. I like it. That I like. As well as their Ouroboros. So we're already all the way up to the Differently, but okay. It's gonna be interesting. I want to go with this. Grand design. Oh shoot! Ah, I did the first blood. Eh. I just lost a lot of damage. Could have had that up to like 600 probably if I let that boy do it. So I messed that up in several cases. Might be right there. Might be good for me to try to be the one evading. Right now I don't even have the machine damage accessory on anyway. So I'm kind of messing up in that sense. You just died, Baldi. I just heard that laser. I didn't even look at the health bar. I just heard that attack and I just, I just said, you just died. Whisper! 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 Whisper!
of fast healers. Far too powerful. So even after all my preparation, I'm still not even ready, but then the worst part is it was never even necessary to do all this in the first place, because it was from the rear, all along. What a development. I have no idea how I passed it. There was... I would love to go back on it and see why in the world I skipped it so blatantly. I looked over for a second. I looked over for a second to reach out, and I fell off a. S Terminal velocity, anyone? Surprised they didn't add those little achievements in again. They had them in one and two. At least I don't think I've seen achievements. I got the hero roster that lets you check out everybody. That's about it. Right? It's not gonna strike us. What are you on about? What is that? That squirrel? I ain't worried about that squirrel. you have such a special moment to take pride in, but I have no idea how I missed it. I can't imagine if I saw it, I'd just oh, walk past don't it. Don't tell me. Have you actually decided to accept my invitation? Well, you know, we do owe you for helping us before. <laughs> I've never heard of anyone entering the Wolf's Den just because they owe someone. <laughs> but how are you even planning on fighting a whole colony alone? Charging at them head on? Ah, you must be the tactician. Got it in one point, Dexter. You're insane. Oh, come now. We live in a world of strife, of constant, unending war. And you question my sanity? Know what? Just sounds like suicide to me. Maybe you really have lost it. You knew that's too far. Even for you. <laughs> oh, shade? Okay, but you did hear her, right? My colony, Colony 11, guards the castle and it's rightly hailed as being impregnable. Not a single Agnian soldier has ever broken through, not even once. I fought long and hard to defend this colony. And now I'm going to bring it down. Just one woman. <laughs> Can you think of anything more satisfying than that? I know I can't. You know what else you're not thinking of? The moment they open fire and turn you to mincemeat, how's that for a punchline? If that happens, I'll do my soldierly duty and turn into a lovely corpse. Oi! 
Hey! <laughs> I'm touched by your concern, but they won't be killing me that easily. All of you, I'm sure you've overcome your own share of hairy situations. We can do this. What would you know? You don't know a thing about us. Don't be such a worry, War Uni. We can do anything if you've got our backs. You're awfully enthusiastic about this, Lance. Y you reckon? Now I think about it, you've known about Ashira since the start. Do you maybe... Mm. Shut up! She's the best defender in Kevez! I'm just some nobody. If somebody told you you get to fight alongside a legend, wouldn't you jump at the chance? <laughs> what an awfully nice thing to say. I'll be looking for some great things from you, uh, uh Lans, was it? Well, uh, 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 <laughs> <laughs> oh, give me a break. <laughs> well then, my dear Ouroboros fellows, what <laughs> say we flustered and flabbergasted all at the same time. <laughs> Man. Female Dunban, real crazy out here. The battle awaits us, one that's sure to prove a most thrilling distraction. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just laughing. It's always good to have a few good battles. Looks like conversations have changed. <laughs> Now that's how you clear ads. Is that an item? Heck yeah. That was super fun. That poor guy. That poor guy. Actually, I don't smash him. Thank you. Actually. He would not have deserved that. Your little gang is causing waves. You were completely ruthless with my lot. <laughs> Do you have I'm to glad talk you let me know like it that. was a back way. Because I was going to sit there and fight that robot and be horribly disappointed. Just so you know, we actually were trying to go easy on them. Oh, no need to hold back. You can wipe the floor with them. That's me giving you the green light as their commander. I heard of some terrible commanders before, but this one takes the biscuit, hands down. You know, there's rumors that some soldiers in Colony 11 are crazy tough. Is that right? Yep. The way I heard it, they have snipers who can shoot you from behind a mountain. Or specialists who can read your mind. Bollocks. Those aren't even good rumors. Ooh, now this sounds interesting. Is there anything they said about me? Huh? Oh, um, yeah. I mean, they might have mentioned some things. Go on, mm -hmm. try me. Even though I can probably guess. They call you Ashira, the Undying Blade. A heroic commander famed throughout Kevers. Another name they use is... Uh... Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> that suicidal maniac. Oh, <laughs> wait, what? She's had, this has been a streak of a name for her. <sighs> okay, I see. Wow, that kind of sucks. Oh, definitely. I was prepared for anything. But this... It's... It's just so bland. So boring. I was hoping for something with more zest, more bite. That's what you're hung up on. <laughs> if you're finished chatting, I'd like us to get moving. 
And don't forget, we're smack dab in the middle of enemy territory. Oops, you're right. Not much time until reinforcements come. I'm feeling a little miserable, but I can take it all out of my men. No problem. <laughs> yep, it's official. We found the worst commander. <laughs> what is going on? Well, now I can just go back to using whatever, I guess, since this is going to be easy cake. I can take care of support. I'll keep us safe from harm. Nothing's getting past me. The offensive then. Support you! Got it! That'll do. It's lame that it doesn't smash unless it, you know, is level 3 there. God dang, she's going in! Team Easel. This is crazy. Now we're here. Mm. 
Colony 11 is only a stone's throw away. I believe it. The final battle is nigh, ladies and gents. Before that, there's one thing I want to confirm. Who is leading the enemy? A type of person you should know very well by this point. Care to make a guess? A consul. I knew it. That idiot has delusions of being a tactician. She's the very definition of a narcissist. I'm sure right now she's drunk on the feeling of controlling the soldiers like puppets. So those soldiers? She's just fleeing them at us against their will, trying to beat us down. Ugh, what a snuffing creep. Makes me want to hurl. I wouldn't pay that too much attention. My guys are enjoying themselves regardless. Oh, really? And how exactly do you figure? Can't you tell from how much of a fight they've been putting up so far? They're seriously coming for blood! Well, mostly mine, of course. So, what? The Consul doesn't even need to force Colony Eleven to attack us? Seems like a stretch, even considering our current company. I couldn't say for certain. They're the same as I am, after all. The more you say, the less I understand. Are you just gonna keep skirting around it? Oh, now, no need to sweat the finer details. All you need to do now is enjoy the fight for what it is. The next battle will be even tougher. Which is to say, that much more fun. Ah, oh, she is crazy. All Good right. to have that Rise band back. Front. The enemy's right ahead. You're talking about your own colony. Oh, how I've needed this character. <laughs> that smarts. Let me have the chest. No. So the traitors have arrived, or perhaps I should call you beasts, driven by my hounds. <laughs> oh my gosh! I would love to see that. Imagine just trying to kill each other day in and day out so you're the consul for colony 11 Ouroboros scum have a care for how you address me with a single order I could have you creatures crushed this instant <sighs> it appears you understand now stay right there. I will dispose of you later. What? First, I'll deal with you, former Commander Ashira. Hey! Rude! With all due respect, Madam Consul, you called us traitors just now. If I, never mind them, am to be accused of the crime of treason, I'm afraid the Great Consul will have to enlighten us as to the reason. Beasts that we are. You are as impudent as ever. But I will explain to you this one time. You engage in battle without orders. Use deviant tactics in battle. You openly violate military regulations. And your worst crime of all? Multiple, unforgivable slights towards a consul. Don't bother trying to deny it. All of the soldiers here have witnessed this. And as a result, we have brought many victories for Gathers. Art glory and military success what the consul desires. And when did I hand out such orders? Never forget that all of you are pawns. A pawn acts as it is placed on the floor. A pawn that acts on its own has no more worth than the mud under my boot. Chirk, talking to her own soldiers like that. However, well, throwing away a silver colony, no matter how rotten, is hardly the action of a wise woman. 
at present. Bringing Colony 11 under my direct control is the more pressing matter. So, you have no further use for me? I should think a suicidal maniac like you would cherish being destroyed by her countrymen. You. Shut your rotten mouth. I see. And it seems you have been laboring under several misconceptions, Madam Consul. Oh, how foolish. You'll use this chance to spout more drivel. Until now, Colony 11 would rush off to battle wherever you waved your hand. But you see, we did it because we wished to. If there was a battle we felt was worthy of us, we soldiers would give our lives fighting it. That's all we ever wanted. My soldiers. And myself. <laughs> what are you driving at? Looking at it another way, nothing else matters to us but that. Not even fighting against people who were our allies until only yesterday. And not even obeying someone who isn't worthy of being our master. Is it dawning on you yet? What? What are you blathering about? The pawns you thought were faithful to you were truly worth less to you than the mud under your boot. Since the very beginning. Cease your confounded blathering! This instant! How dare you! Oh, this is getting on my nerves. If it's all the same to you, I'd really like to drop it now. So, come and kill me, if you can. seen everything. <laughs> Getting scared, are you? Do I look scared? No, you really don't. Just forget it. Ashira, don't underestimate her. She's not like anything else you've fought. Yeah, I'm getting that impression. Well then, Ouroboros. Time for the fight we've all been waiting for. Dang, she ugly. Yeah. God. God. You okay, Morbius? Hey, yo. God dang. You already know it's about to happen. Oh, it did. I'm okay with that guy. She got top of it there! Oh 
Oh, that was funny. You're all pawns. Nothing but pawns. She's still alive. Hmm. What's wrong? Go on. Kill me. Isn't that what you want? You animal. Hmm. Nope. What? What? Queen's wings, have you lost the snuffing plot? She's Mobius, she's the enemy. Yeah, but ending it like this... How should I put it? Oh, I know. It's a waste. <laughs> Are you insane? <laughs> In fact, never mind. Forget I asked. There you have it, Madam Consul. You can make a strategic retreat. Do whatever. I don't mind. If you're planning revenge, by all means, pay Colony Eleven another visit. You... You bitch! God dang. Or, if you actually definitely do want to die, I have no qualms in speeding you along. You will pay for making me look a fool. You'll pay dearly. The Consul. Mobius. She's more dangerous than you know. Oh, I know that. That's why I'm expecting big things from her. <laughs> wow. I don't know what to say. This woman is something else. Right. A victory needs fireworks. Fireworks. Make it something big. You came all this way. Um, is she saying what I think she's saying? She does have a point, I suppose. You guys are a silver colony. You sure about this? Didn't you hear my speech? I said nothing else matters. Not to us. So? Got you. Here we go! Oh, Lord. So cool. 
There. You're all free now. No need to fight. No need to take life from others. Hmm. I wonder if you can really call that freedom. Hmm? Care to explain? My soldiers and I, we were never fighting for the sake of earning life in the first place. Back up, back up. Surely you had to be, right? I mean, that's the usual setup. True, true. Normally you'd fight to keep the clock fed. Only natural. Otherwise you're dead. But for us, we live so we can fight. It's how we've lived our lives. Living to fight sounds kind of awful. You must understand, now that you've crossed blades with my troops, they didn't follow the Consul's orders because they were frightened for their lives. We were using the situation we're in to our advantage. Huh? What's the point of that? I should think it's obvious. We hope that someday we can have a proper fight to the death with mighty warriors like you. I've taken part in all these battles to make that dream real. That's all. I... I see. No, not I see, Senna. Just think about it for a sec. These guys have been killing each other, having their own little murder party. It's crazy. Yep, if you're gonna be blunt about it, then that's exactly what it was. That doesn't make it any better. All this living to fight crap. How many lives will you need to take before you're satisfied? Or maybe you want to die, is that it? Yes. I want to die. Oh my gosh. Good try. <laughs> Wait. You ain't serious. Is it that surprising? A soldier like you should... Grow the snuff up. Hmm? Grow up, I said. So you want to fight? You want to die? What the snuff is your problem? Shut up, Shadow. You come out with all this highfalutin crap, but really, that console was right about you. You're nothing but bloodthirsty beast, aren't you? H hang on, Uni. You listen. You ain't gonna involve us in your stupid suicidal quest. Just leave us alone, all right? Uni, that was out of... Point Dexter. Wow, I am pretty exhausted after all this. I think I'll take a load off somewhere. Oh, you can all make yourselves at home. Consider it a thank you for joining the fight. Ashira, shouldn't we? Well then, I'll be off. What you do is up to you. Uni, that was not cool. I want you to apologize later. Please tell me you're not taking her side. Everyone should be free to choose how they want to live their life. Wasn't Ethel the same? Oi, she's nothing like Ethel, got it? Well, that's for sure. But you did kind of go overboard there. Uni, I know how you feel, but could you try? Fine, you win, whatever. I'll talk to her, will that do? Sure. Looks like colony relations have changed. Huh. I'll follow you. Crazy. Uh. I hope we can make use of this.
I'm gonna loot their whole colony, that's for sure. Together now. On it. I hope we can make use of this. Like it's over the side. That worked. Hold on. Okay. Wonder what's inside. Let's go talk to the Psycho Dunban woman. I hope y'all are ready, because I don't know what in the world she's... Ooh, she's crazy. Hi. Hmm? Um... I mean, well, I, I want to talk about before. Look at her playing with her wing. That, that's kind of cute, not gonna lie. I'm sorry. I went too far. <laughs> what are you laughing at? I'm being serious here. Ah, oh, no, sorry, sorry. It's just, you surprised me. And I don't think you went too far. What you said was the unvarnished truth. And that stuff about wanting to die? Even without flame clocks, people die at some point. Be it sooner or later. So, before that happens, I want to leave my mark on this world. Some kind of proof that we were here, in the short time we've been given. For me, that is what I want to achieve by dying. Sorry, I still don't get it. It seriously just sounds like you want to destroy yourself. Dying to fight and fighting to die are different. Though they might sound the same. If I can make my death mean something, then I can finally prove my life had value. Live fiercely, die spectacularly. That's how I want the battlefield of my life to be. Well, all that said, looking from the outside, all people see is the suicidal maniac. And Colony 11 is the last refuge for people like us. <laughs> Isn't that funny? I don't see the joke. You really are insane. <laughs> How many times have you said that today? <laughs> I suppose. But, you know, hmm? Whoa, no. At least now I get that you're not enough of an idiot to throw yourself off the top of here. And your life really is yours to do with as you see fit. It's not my place to go off on you just because we don't see eye to eye. Besides, the way you fight, fearless and fierce and all that, 
Honestly, it's kind of awesome. Yeah? Think so, eh? What? Revving up for another dig? No. How do I put it? No one's ever talked that way to me before. I guess... I'm happy? Maybe? You ain't embarrassed, are you? You! <laughs> this is priceless! Yeah? Couldn't you tell I was joking? I really seriously hate you. Wow. Aww, that hurts! And here I was taking a liking to you. I mean, from now on, we're all fellow rebels. So, you know. You and I should be friends, Uni. We did it. <laughs> what a crazy quest. The Shiro the Undying Blade joins the party. Oh, something. You got a little more than I'll burn you, energy. My lord, she's insane. In the best way possible for a world like this, though, if you ask me. Ah, uh, class inheritor. At first I thought it was going to be cheap and, you know, lands would get it for being fanboy, but now... Ashera and Uni have had a whole arc together. So, could be Uni for sure after that. But they could just pull a complete Sidewinder off on me and really catch me off guard. Oh, Uni's got the burn you energy. No, yes, that Uni did. Uni definitely did have it there. You're right about that, for sure. Alright, I'm giving this to Uni, but let's see. Huh? Uh -huh. They kept it nice and straightforward for us this time. <sighs> Accumulates heavy aggro through attacks. Can also counterattack when an ally in range has been attacked. Hmm. This Are sounds you tired? pretty serious. We can rest a while. That'd be welcome. I'm seriously knackered. This kid's gonna be slapping yo. Give me food. Let's make the most of our break, guys. Heck yeah, this is the dish I've been waiting for. I've been needing the class points to go up. Mmm, delicious. I've got the gold and I've got quite a few other oh, things. I needed that. Woo! <sighs> So that's a new recipe then. I'll save that progress, my lord. It's good to keep a record. So crazy. Let's bounce. What is it you're looking so for? Much choice. Mmm, smash damage. Typical stuff. Yeah, yeah. Is this the gate where the evil robot is? Shall we get going and assault the castle then? <laughs> oh, you're pretty casual about it, huh? It's like you're asking for what's for lunch. 
That's great. He'll fit right in. What freaking castle are y'all attacking? Are you going in there and breaking up? What? These people are crazy. Absolutely insane. <gasps> About the annihilator. <laughs> they really have nothing but battle on the brain. It is hilarious. Glad here's the lieutenant. What are you looking at? Okay you then. Want more names? A silent type. You could be a protagonist. I see some relations have changed. Getting a lot of love today. Like, what in the world? All the skills and arts. Boost aggro generated from dealing damage. Boost damage dealt when attacking higher level enemies. When nearby allies attack, deal 100% of attack damage to enemy. Reduces damage taken by 20% when HP is at 30% or lower. Not bad. Are them arts of Vaden? Let's generate aggro. We're going to make use of that launch there. Boost damage dealt by 30% and aggro drawn when attacking by 25%. Cool. Some dance. I love it. I'm excited. Get quirky with it. Let's 
So I gotta fight my way across that bridge if I want to get the rest of that land, huh? So wait, what did I miss over here? I guess it's... I don't remember doing that. I need to go through this area again, because there's clearly a lot of stuff I missed. I actually didn't mean to do this just yet. As much as I want to put Uni on that, that getting past me. Just getting chased around way too much. This just doesn't seem right. It could have been. That gone. I don't know why my surface keeps doing this if the case is giving it trouble so like the screen on this surface that I use to monitor chat huh? will start vibrating and it's hey, like super crazy something? looking I'm gonna take it out of its case hmm. see if it every needs day is a training move. day I mean, it's my super old Surface Pro, so can't be too upset if it's broken. But if you were saying it's scary that that's happening, then yes, it is a little scary. But I guess I can't be too upset. Just means I need to figure out a way to get a second monitor. See if it calms down once it starts to breathe a bit. But yeah, like you were saying, I guess I was hyper-focused on the story because I was dying to know what in the world was the deal with the queen. Watch your footing, guys. spot and that 
container, I guess. Yeah, I see why I didn't do a lot down here. Talk Something for value here. Heart Peach. Thirty levels above these guys, and there's still a chance they could kill me. Yeah, I wish I could tell you how I skipped over that so hard. What's inside? I feel like I would have at least picked it up even if I went straight for the story still. But I was not really one to be turning down the hero quests. I was all four of them. So I probably really will go back and find out why why this happened. Here's a goodie. It's a nice find, right? Right? Mmm, shiny. So weird how this tablet screen does what it does. Huh. This has got to be worth a bunch. Huh. Time to take the fast way. The fast way. Here, do some sending off. We can't just leave this be. Can 
never go wrong with some ether. Free money. Nighty night, Mick. Enjoy the stream. We will. We're getting it. It's happening. Enjoying it for sure, though. Thank you, mate. Enjoy your sleep. Still, whoa, higher still. Huh. Good thing we found this. Heart peach just sounds tasty. Huh. Watch your footing, guys. I feel like it would add a little bit of time onto your life force. it like so okay of course ah uh, of course I can't believe how hard I tunnel vision here. Uh, I guess I really must have. That's insane. There's so much stuff I hardly even paid attention to.
I've done this from the beginning. But I got the wrong idea about its location, guys. Darn it. Here we go. Uh, the exploration of this game is astonishing. You think you've done an area, and then you find a little secret area, and then it freaking links into a whole another section. And you get a cutscene that plays that shows you, yeah, no, there's way more area than you thought. Uh, I just can't believe it. So much to this game. Charge off on your own. We're sliding down. Never seen this place before. Up I go. Oh, 
from being a lot. It seems like it's really not being that aggressive. I say as I get knocked out. She does it. So it does have to be her order specifically. It seems. It's my Still got it. Let's see who 
Who's got D rank classes left? Not available to him yet. But he will. No, I will. good with you. Already done with that. B, B. Done the whole top row. B, A. S rank. C, B. B. Why is everybody like so content? Somebody be bad at something already. Okay, we'll level up the word medic for you. Since you're not gonna like the word medic. Perfect. And now we can acquire more and more silver coins. Super glad we got that character. Cause I started noticing I was missing a character, and I knew I wanted that one like a lot. Unfortunately, none of those arts were made for evasion, which is kind of surprising. I really thought some of those were going to be evasion based. There's not a whole lot of evade built in. Like there was any actually. But hey, I'm definitely gonna be using it. Seems strong, huh? Huh? Like so. Okay. Have it. Oh, yeah. Still laughing, wrapping around the island, actually. Looks like we're just heading towards a container. Too, too crazy. Yes, indeed. Wonder what's inside. That'll do. Those actually. Well, now, ain't that a challenge? Keep your heads or lose them. Six colonies of me on the job. Buddy. You want some more? Get caught up in this. 
Watch that little guy next to the big guy now got caught up in this one. Don't stick with my cat girl. Cat girl. Fan attack goes. Alright. Oh no, if it'll kill, I feel like it could. I know one day they're gonna be super strong. Once I finally know what I'm doing. Okay. Resistant like that, huh? Break this time. No real way to go further than the top of that. Oh, this 
the gall. is such an incredible thing. Mouth agog. Living is so blue through air. Charge in the castle. Bang, bang, mega bus. 
must share details of amazing gothic spectacle with other caravan. Yes. Being the dumb. It was here all along. Huh. I hope we can make use of this. Holy cow. Could that have hit and killed us? Because that looks super deadly. What the heck? Oh, enemies! Wait, they're all gonna fight us? Eyes over here! Thanks! Who ah. keep them in check?
Oh boy. Oh boy, there they go. They just smash the enemy monster. Right Chain attack on him. Damn. No side break. Hey, that works. This isn't the end. So that's how you do it. This is the decider. So much ether on this island and nothing I can do with it. This is something decent, right? We've been spotted. I feel like doing work by you. I hope we can make use of this.
Oh, oh, oh. Not ready for that. And I'm close to level, but I have to go and get classes that are set up for that. That was only mildly horrifying. Such a useful thing to do. Chances are I'm going to get annihilated the moment I do, if I'm even allowed through without killing that thing. Ah. some sort of laser beam. Okay. I didn't die. Cool. So all you end up doing is entering anyway. Looks like Shall it's like the way out. I hit fine. Eyes over here. You're a lifesaver. Warrior! Oh, yeah. So many fields and stuff, it's not even funny.
Okay. I think her coming out as a Ouroboros was enough to finish that fight. I hope we can make use of this. Dare they be so attentive on their guard posts? I'm here to not get caught, I guess. I don't really know what I'm here to do. All I know is that I need. What's this now? Yeah, let's definitely grab it. Oh, enemies! I'll hold them off. I so was trying to turn around. Not what the heck? Like oh, the flight well traveled by now, huh? It lets me leave out and it's just shattered so you can't step back in there. Or maybe they just want you to take the elevator in? I don't know. Hoping. Uh, that smarts. Huh. Huh. All right. Well, I think I've had my fun. I'm not really sure that I'll figure out how to navigate more of this area. Though I may want to know what's going on all around here. It's something I'll do at a later time. Probably could do it now. 
Like I said earlier, my stomach's kind of bothering me. Of course, that's not the end of the world, but it's just no fun. And it has been a nine and a half hour stream almost, so. Oh, we might just start wrapping up. still have the desire to beat the heck out of that punk over there. How smug it is. We'll come at another time. How do I untarget it? Look away from it. Where is everybody? Oh well. <sighs> well, yeah. We're 80 hours into this game. Record. And I am still not done. And quite honestly, I feel like I'm hardly at the halfway point, but the hours. The hours tell me I'm close to the end. We'll see how it plays out. I just. This game is something. Ooh, but yeah, I'm wrapping it up here, y'all. See if I can let my stomach get to feeling better. It's actually starting to really not be very pleasant. Ooh. Alrighty, y'all. It's been wonderful. I look forward to more on the next one. Um. I'm sure I'll end up streaming tomorrow as well, but we'll see. I don't want to make any promises. But, 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 I appreciate y'all for hanging out and watching. Hope you enjoyed it as much as I did. And I will be catching you all on the next stream. So bye-bye for now.